going on, everybody? How's it going? What's up, Circuity? I see that you're lurking, so you probably might not hear me. How's everybody doing today? Hope everybody having a good Wednesday. How's it going, Owie? Little peach tree, let's go. Thank you, Owie, for little peach treats. You still playing uh, Outriders, Owie? So I'm wearing these uh, earbuds for probably half the stream today. And uh, I already know I don't like them because my other headset, my normal headset, they have like this thing called side tone. And that allows me to hear myself a little better while I talk. Cause when you're, when you got the headphones on, right? It's like all muffly and stuff. But uh, the side tone allows you, allows the sounds to come into your ears a little bit so that you could hear yourself talk. So like right now, these are just regular earbuds, right? So they don't have that. And um, it sounds like I need to yell. Whoa, why does my character... Wait, wh which one's my character? Those are not me. That's super weird. Hey, what's going on? I could hardly hear her, man. I gotta fix some sounds or something. Come on, dude. Uh, yes, but I haven't played any today. I also kind of want to play some Vermintide 2. Huge update today. I have... I think I, that's on Steam, right? I think I feel like I saw that recently on Steam. Like today, actually. Uh, what is it? I don't actually know what the game is, though. It's on sale right now, 75%. Is it something I might like? Horde mode? Is it co-op? Lakota? What's good, dude? Uh, four player co op. Think Left 4 Dead. Oh, that sounds kind of fun then. Play together. Um, how are you not feeling well? I am fine. I'm sorry to hear that you're not doing well, Lakota. Uh, not feeling well. My health's not the best moment. I found out I lost my job just to my daughter not having a babysitter. Oh no, I'm really sorry to hear that, Lakota. That really. Sucks. Um, I hope you feel better soon. And I hope um, the other stuff gets situated as well. I'm really sorry to hear that, Lakota. Safe zone. The bastards are on me. Who's shooting? 
Hey, JJ, what's going on? Oh, no, I fell. Oh, no, no, no. Rip, rip. <laughs> oh, we can't get picked up here. Terrible. Doing all right, day off. Ooh, nice. Day off uh, for fun or day off cause stuff? Hopefully day off for fun. Uh, let me see if I have Steam open. Check out that uh, Vermintide. I also had coffee today, actually, are we? I normally don't have coffee, but it was a treat yourself kind of situation. Uh, I guess I don't have Steam open right now, so I'll probably check that out on the browser. Hello, Pickle Dicks. Scheduled day off. Cool. Oh, there's bone arrows. Mama Lee. Wow, that is uh that YouTube video is super struggling to watch the trailer, so I guess I'm uh not watch the trailer right now. Hey, what's going on, man? Vermintide is 80-something gig installed. Oh my god, huge. Hey, what's going on? My mom also made me coffee. It's not good. Rip. I, uh, I didn't add any sugar to my coffee today. I, uh... Almost was, but I didn't. It's just a uh, regular coffee with the uh, cream. Coffee? Never add sugar, I'm a bitter girl. Boo. You're a salt girl. Well, actually, I don't know about salt. You're a not sugar girl. That's all I know. Got that satch life. Enemy UAV overhead. Enemy dropping into the AO. Do sugar and cream? Ooh. Yeah, I usually do sugar and cream. 
but decided to not today. Don't think I can go back to milk and coffee? I honestly, is there a difference? I mean, obviously there is, but I can't, I don't think I can really taste a difference. Oh my God, this guy's using the RC rip. Like between milk and coffee, I mean milk and cream. I mean, I'm sure it does taste different. I just, uh, I use them kind of interchangeably. As in when I go to coffee shop, I'm just like, whatever. Like, I don't really care, like, you know. What's going on, brother? Yeah? How's it going, dude? Another stream said there's some Warzone event today, new map. <sighs> you know what? I don't really know. I, um, there is definitely something happening. I don't know about on this map, uh, on the regular Warzone map. Yeah, I think there is something happening. Uh, there's like a gas thing that happened there. And, uh, we'll, we'll roll in there. So uh, we check that out, but oh god, no rip. There's there were certain areas I saw the map that had um gas that would take down your health, and then you can use like a syringe or something to heal yourself. Um. I don't know exactly what that means. Like maybe there's uh, more loot in those areas now or something. I don't really know. Uh, we'll check it out though. We'll check it out. They mentioned something about Verdansk getting nuked or something at 3 p.m. Eastern. Hey, that's uh, gonna be later. Then I guess we'll find out. I guess we'll see what that ha what that means. Nuke event. You're right. 25 gig uh, Warzone update. Yes, I downloaded that actually today. So I guess we'll see uh, what that means. Activision has yet to announce exactly what will happen during the event, but we know the Verdansk map will be nuked before a 1980s themed version is ushered in. 1980s. Interesting. Okay. Cool. I'm down. Let's uh, we'll check that out for sure. Thanks for uh, letting me know that, uh, Brother Xiao. Appreciate it. I guess, uh, I guess, yeah, they had a certain like four or five spots on Verdansk map um, that had like gas things. <coughs> Maybe those are the first areas that will get nuked or something. I don't know. Do we get to watch the nuking? That's what I'm here for. I mean, yeah, I guess. Yeah. We'll definitely play till at least three something just to see what the event is. I was going to do scum later um well we can wait till a little bit later to do it too it's fine hey what's going on man he wants a vehicle weird
There's three players out here. Oh god. There's a sniper down there, watch out. Enemy precision airstrike, take cover. Arms mobile. Enemy UAV overhead. What? I hate this guy. He's probably gonna push. Oh, how I fall down. Yeah, it's close. Where is he? Oh, you're not gonna know. There's nothing in there. Don't you keep respawning me over here? Because the map is small AF. I feel like there's someone here, but... Oh, two of them run. SMG located. We gotta go, gas. Oh, I didn't even see him. God. Super blind. I didn't even see him. He was right in front of my face. Rip. Ah. I didn't see him or I didn't hear him. And I didn't hear him. I wonder if I should just switch back to my other headsets. Because these just aren't as good for like surround sound or whatever. Also, we are on the second trays of our Invisaligns. And uh, we are talking funny again, just slightly, very slightly. And my teeth, like I put them in last night. I heard that the trick was to um, put in the new trays uh, at night. So then the worst part of it happens overnight. So that you're, uh, so when you wake, wake up, uh, your teeth aren't as bad. Spam, <laughs> spam, spam. Definitely S words are a lot harder. Like issues is like a weird word for me to say, issues. Um, but like my teeth, like as soon as I put them in, they were like super tight. And then, um, it almost feels like, you know, how when you get like something stuck in your teeth, in between your teeth, you need to like use a toothpick or whatever. It's, uh, it's kind of like that. Like right now, just the trays are super tight in there. And then when I woke up this morning, it didn't feel too bad. And then uh, I took them out for lunch for a little bit and then put them back in again. And it felt like the same as last night. Uh, it felt like there was like stuff in my teeth again. Sally sold she seashells by the seashore. Sally sold seashells by the seashore. Sally sold seashells by the seashore. Sally sold seashells by the seashore. Sure. Oh boy. Yeah. Yeah, S word's definitely harder. Rip. <laughs> but hopefully in a few days, um, probably in a day or two. Probably, uh, probably be better. <laughs> yeah, what's going on, Dead Gnome? I can't see that without a visible light. Nice. Oh, let me get a blue teeth tree.
Thank you, Pickle Dicks. What's going on, Dead Dome? How is your Wednesday? Hey, what's going on? I feel like I can't really hear these people. I have no idea what the hell he said. Working and lurking. Nice. Um, it's at your best game though. Um, just like you. Oh, you. I think they're on the roof. What the heck? I should have gotten around the corner a little more. Oh my god, rip. I'm blaming my bad performance on a uh, these earbuds that I'm using right now. I feel like I want to email the uh, people up on my desk and be like, so you haven't forgotten about my desk, right? My wobble board came that I want to be using with my standing desk. That just came today. I haven't even taken it out of the box. That first thing you were going to say, blame your performance on uh, Invisalign? <laughs> uh, no. Unfortunately, I can't use that one as an excuse. <laughs> I think, uh, mostly it's things sound kind of different in my, uh, in this, in the earbuds. Like, there's no, um, there's no, like, equalizer. I mean, there is an equalizer for the Go XLR. But, it is different than my previous, my other headset, so things just sound kind of differently. And uh, I don't know. I was thinking of getting some noise canceling. Um, get wrecked. I was thinking of getting some noise canceling earbuds and seeing if that uh, would help. Wireless noise canceling earbuds. But I also don't know if I wanna wear earbuds in my um, ears for like six hours, like every day. But I'll probably do like half, half the stream with earbuds and half the stream without earbuds. Cause I'm sure probably plugging my ears for six hours my ear holes for six hours at a time is probably not that great. Lurkies, thanks for the lurk for the show. Noise canceling would be nice though, so I could get block, obviously noise cancel, other stuff. So we'll probably get them see how they how they're working out.
Oh god, I was hoping he was running the other way. Got him. Fuck on the other end. I'm gonna run. I think he told his buddy on me, so I'm gonna get out of here. Probably depends on the earbuds fit and how aggressive the NC is, the noise canceling. Yeah. Oh no, I'm being hunted. Yeah, I don't know. Rip. Enemy UAV overhead. Have to just get them and try them out, I guess. I think those guys went. We got so much money, dude. I definitely know that I want wireless. Because this cable dangling right in front of me is, uh... not my favorite. Oh man. Oh man. The the cable dangling in front of me is definitely not my favorite. Which means if I get wireless I'm gonna have to get a uh, bluetooth transmitter and then I need a audio splitter. I have a pair of Bose noise cancelling at work, and AirPods Pro and Max at home. The noise cancelling of the Max uh, is best. Uh, Bose is next, the Pro is last. Also, the Pro just don't stay put. So I have a pair of AirPods. Is it AirPods Pro? I have the... Yeah, I have AirPods Pro. I have them, but um, I think they're fine. Like, I don't think that they sound the best like i want something that's you know good for gaming so like i don't know how those work specifically for like kind of surround sound or spatial sounding stuff you know what i'm saying i don't know how well those work for that like i don't know if they make really good uh wireless earbuds for gaming for surround type stuff um I have uh, Bose noise canceling headphones, but like I said, I'm trying to stay away from headphones, possibly if I can. And uh, I suspect that my jaw is going to be hurting for the next like year and a half. And while I have no problems with my Arctis Wireless Pro, I feel like I'm going to have to like switch and can't use them throughout the whole day. Like maybe I could do half a day with them. Hey, what's going on?
I know what you're saying. Don't think Pro are really made for that. Yeah, I don't think so either. So, like, I'm having trouble finding stuff that is for that. AKG K712 Pro looks nice, not wireless though, also expensive, 550 USC. Yeah, that's way too expensive. Especially because I don't even really want to buy them to begin with. Like, I'm kind of forced to, just because my jaw freaking hurts. It wasn't, it's not really an expense that I uh, was expecting. Yeah, that kind of sucks. But yeah, I wasn't expecting uh, my headphones to hurt my jaw, so this was a unexpected <sighs> expense I had to deal with. So kind of sucks. Let's go! Enemy UAV How about the Sennheiser HE1? I mean, that sounds like a pretty good deal, but also, does it suck then if it's that cheap? Like, I saw those, they have like Razer, um, whatever ones for like 60 bucks. And, I mean, I am kind of like a Razer fanboy, but I'm not sure if I'm that much of a fanboy. As in, I'd rather get a brand that's a lot better at audio than I think uh, Razer probably is. So I'm looking at brands like Bose, Sennheiser, probably Sony, those kind of things. Like I want to buy a pair that's going to last and not give me um, issues, right? But I also don't want to like Spend five hundred dollars. I think my price range is probably two to three hundred. Where is this um box? I hear something, but Oh no! I'm pretty sure there's like three teams or two teams in here. Oh no, they're coming. Oh god! 
I just like the Razer, no, not so much. I mean, the peripherals that I have, I mean, the keyboard and mouse, I don't have, you know, that much of an issue or anything. But I don't think they're a leading brand in headphones. Maybe they are, maybe they're not, I don't really know. But I'm a pretty big fan of Bose and Sennheiser. And probably Sony is probably pretty decent at audio, I imagine. What? How did he not get dead? There's like two other people that he passed for sure. Oh no no. Rab. <laughs> oh, GG. Came on the roof. Oh, what? Sennheiser HE 159K. Oh, whoops. I I totally missed that. <laughs> I was like, "What? They sell a pair of earbuds for 60 bucks? It's pretty cheap." Oh, that's the um amplifier. But that will sound good. It is 59,000. Literally straight from Sennheiser. $59,000 flat. No cents. Looks like it's like vacuum tubes. Wow, it's like... Really nice looking. Actually. It's like granite, like the bottom is like granite or something. Marble? Yeah, marble. Not granite, sorry. It looks really nice. At that price, uh, you can't hear the sounds over the tears of all the money you spent. Nice. I mean, I, I was actually just going to ask who the hell buys things like that, but I mean, there are definitely people that buy things like that. I'm not me, though. Wait, the AKG Pro Audio, whatever, whatever. But those are just headphones, though. I don't want headphones. I want earbuds, I think. I was also thinking of, like, bone conductor stuff. Has anyone had bone conductor stuff like that? That wouldn't go in my ears, which is probably better. But then I also don't think... Because they usually have, like, kind of, like, the wraparound style. That's usually how, the, how those work. But I don't think that would be comfortable for me. Guess I'm jumping in hot by myself. Oh no, they came from downstairs? Shit. <laughs> Mini rocket launch tradition, right? <laughs> I mean, it's as good as weapon as any, right? I certainly wasn't going to be sniping indoors with that 50 cal or whatever it was. But Tundra, I think. I've tried Bone Conductor, don't believe the hype. Um, hmm. Like, I think they work well, probably, for, like, if you're outdoors, like, running or something. Like, that would be probably really nice, but... 
They also, like, Bose also has those uh, bone conductor ones, too. But they're not rated very high. Like, people find that they're kind of uncomfortable. Like, they don't... There's no good position for it to be in. Like, they kind of... It's just, like, ear hooks. They don't have a wraparound that goes around your neck, which I don't think I want, which is fine. That's good. Um, but they have, like, the ear hook. So I'm wondering if that would be okay or not. Or I should just, like, just get regular wireless earbuds and just trade off after a while and just do the headphones. I'm probably thinking that. I have hearing loss. Spending uh, that much would be pointless. I mean, if you got sixty thousand to spend on an amp, you may as well put sixty thousand dollars into like hearing aids or like stuff for your ears or something. I don't know. Their products have been sold for years. Uh, seen a bone conductor thingy pop up a couple times. Have the site but marks, but they ain't selling stuff yet. Yeah, like, I don't, I'm not sure if I would use, uh, I don't know. Like, uh, DT has a pair. He's probably busy, so he's probably not talking about it, but he has a pair. I sh might try it just to see, but I don't like the, I don't really like the wraparound. So I would be curious to see if the, uh, microphone picks it up or not. Because obviously I don't want that. <laughs> Obviously, I definitely don't want, you know, microphone picking it up. Should have lambed up top. I was up top. What? Dr. Lincoln gaming setup. Cool. Rip. Are you from the EU? If yes, click here to visit other sites. Wow. I'm gonna get the dubs, good luck, have fun, gonna lurk. Alright, thanks Lee, thanks for coming in, man. Appreciate it, hope you're having a good day. Um, owie, I am looking on my side monitor. Cables though, I mean it's like not true wireless. Not a fan of the non-true wireless. I may as well get cable then, I think, maybe. I down him. I got two shotguns, bro. Is he? Is he not in this house? Guess he's not in this house. I thought he was here.
God, it's so loud in my ears. <laughs> Boom. Boom, let's go. Let's go, JJ. Thank you, JJ. Appreciate it, dude. Appreciate the support, JJ. Thank you so much, dude. Coming in hot. Let's go. Where are these people? They're like all here, right? Oh, they're in that room. There's two. One's down, one's up. Stop them. Hey, Architectonic, how's it going, dude? Oh my god. It's on top of prison. Go for loadout. I am definitely going for a loadout. Let's go, please. I need that loadout. No, this helicopter is flying over my body. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I misclicked. I misclicked. <laughs> oh, thank you, JJ. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you for contributing to the microphone goal. Dude, you walked into... I didn't walk into the heli. The heli landed... On my position. There's a difference. <laughs> God. Yeah, the heli was coming for me. That's why I got on the far side of the box so that they could at least probably not just ram into my body, you know? You know what I'm saying? Little pea treat. Let's go. Thank you, JJ, for little pea tree. Wait, do you want to be Uncle JJ? You can be Uncle JJ if you want. Hey, what's going on? Battle Royale. Gas is approaching your position. Move to the safe zone. Nothing. Rip. Do cats and bunnies get along? I mean, I think any animals can really get along if they, uh... Oh, wow, that guy left. Okay, rip. At least I, uh, I broke their armor. Yo, what's going on, Steve? -o? How's it going, dude? Hope you're having a good day, Steve. -o. Thanks for being here, dude. People who bail after a round start are legit the worst. I wonder what they're thinking. Like, are they like, they just don't like my name? They don't like my voice? They got disconnected? Their mom was yelling for them because dinner's ready? They have to go to bed? They gotta do homework? Like, what's, what's the situation? They have really shitty internet, so they disconnect? Like, what's the deal here? I'm good. How are you today? I am doing pretty decently. Thank you, Steve-O. 
We got the new trays in for my Invisalign for my mouth. So my jaw hurts, my teeth hurts. I sound weird, make weird S noises when I talk. But other than that, we're doing well. Thanks, Steve-o. Another no teammates game. Yay, perfect. Maybe I'll jump into regular regular Verdansk soon. Then you guys can see the uh, little like the circles on the map for the gas. See how that goes. Gotta go move some pavers out of my car. Pavers? Alright, pickle dicks. We'll be here. Little circles of gas. Yes, dead gnome. I think it's uh, new for the update that happened today. Uh, in Warzone map, there are little circles across the map. It's 150 gigs? No, I don't think so. I think it's like... Bro. Oh my god. I think it's a 25, uh, 25 gig update. That was like today. So apparently at 3 p.m. Uh, Dead Gnome, there's supposed to be some kind of nuke event happening on Verdansk. So... Keep your eyes peeled in about an hour and uh, we'll see what that means. They didn't uh, tell us what's happening. There's just some kind of nuke event. Not nude event, nuke event. So we'll just have to see what happens there. I'll show you the map when I get into the game. Boom, 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 boom. Whoa, Tracer Pack, Stoner's Delight. The green purple. What does this look like? I don't care about the stoners part, but I care about the purple part of the tracers. Wow, that is one ridiculous looking. What the tracers look like though? Can't see it. Looks like the tracers are purple. I don't see any green part of the tracers at all. Hmm. I'm trash at war zones. I haven't been in a round in a bit. I'm pretty trash too, as you can see. <laughs> pretty trash as well. But, you know, honestly, I enjoy the, the gunplay and the tactics and the strategies in this game. Get yourself sorted. I like the sniping. Because snipe life. No. Okay, so you can't see him in on the map yet. But so so when I was playing earlier and I was at I was walking around airport and it was like this huge like kind of bolt and scroller thing that went across the screen and it was like a warning, like saying something's gonna happen. And then I think that's when the circles appeared on the screen. On the map. So hopefully I stay alive long enough so that we can see that. We'll see, because I'm gonna drop at airport hangars and don't know. 
Okay, so let's look. It's got the uh, nuke uh, symbol or something at Superstore. It's like... So this was the last zombie place, but then I think now the new zombie place is the um, dam. So I don't know what's going to happen at, at Superstore or what that circle is. I don't know. All this stuff is new to me. I think it just got an update today, so... Bro, that drop shot. So nuke event? Yeah, there's like a, some kind of nuke, nuke event situation happening. Maybe a mini gas bubble that expands similar to a nuclear event. Um, yeah, maybe. Okay, yeah, look, so check it out. There's different uh, areas on the map marked now. So I think... You say, so there's six, uh, six circles that have them. There are, there's just six circles right now. Hey, what's this? Oh, it's a vehicle. Up, Weird. Um, the so there are six uh, circle gas bubbles on the map right now. Up, now I wonder if there'd be more and more in the next hour. I wonder if there'll be more circles as we go towards the next hour. Hey, we're in the uh, we're in a bubble. Okay, well, rip. I think maybe, um, since we're in the bubble, maybe when the countdown starts, the, it will... Oh shit, it's already gassy. I don't want to be in here. Rip, rip, my health. Okay, well, I'm like... Took half my armor. One armor plate. Uh, that is bonkers. I die fast enough. I just don't need more things to keep me... Right? I think it's, um, it's more like stay out of those areas, I think. As opposed to kill you faster. I mean, you will die faster, obviously. But I think it's more like just keep out of those areas. Jesus Christ. Right. Well, those guys can duke it out, and I'm gonna go under them. I got 43 rounds left. I'm gonna piece out of here. Jump down. Come down maybe the front door. Or something. Side door. Probably give me a little more ammo, though. Why did that... Wait, why are those things despawn? Enemy UAV overhead. 
See this uh, this thing, the warning thing. I'm not sure what that does. Alert, containment protocol level four active. Please take shelter immediately. I don't know what that means. Oh god, shit, rip. That's another guy. That's a different dude. Alright, well, uh, alright, I'm gonna do a better- I'll do a better job, uh, in the next round. To try to stay alive and see what happens there with that. Sorry, rip. to the hydrate castle. Alright, this time I'm gonna legitimately try to land far enough away where uh, we don't die. Mm, so we can check out that level 4 whatever protocol thing. Containment protocol. When is Outriders? Um... Never. Alright, Yep. Sorry, Castle. Is that title right? Playing Scum today too? Uh, yeah. I think I'm gonna try Scum later. Why, uh, you, you play Scum? Dead no? I have before, yeah. So I just started playing that. So, um, uh, you know, Creek from uh, chat here, he, uh, he got me into that game and, uh, I bought it a couple days ago and, uh, I started playing. And, uh, I'm kind of enjoying it to be honest. I might have like, less than 10 hours in the game so far and i'm currently just um playing single player mode pretty sure there's a guy that landed in the next thing yo what's going on magus thanks for the raid dude hope you're doing well how's everybody doing today Um, so yeah, I, uh, probably gonna try, uh, to stream scum in a little bit, but I do want to see the, um, 
nuke event thing happen and see what's up with that before we do that. Where did that guy land? He was, uh, super here. It's pretty fun. I don't play regular. It's a good one if you need something different. Yeah. Uh, so I didn't need something different, but yeah, it was totally different though. I agree, yeah. It was, uh, definitely something different. Compared to the games I normally play, right? And, uh, it's almost kind of relaxing. Almost. Almost kind of relaxing for me. Almost. Well, almost because the zombies almost, like, give me heart attacks. Like, uh, I was, uh, oh my god, zone. Rip. Okay, you can't go there. <laughs> Um, yeah, it, it was, uh, for the most part, uh, it's pretty fun, relaxing. You're just kind of running through the woods, basically, right? There's, like, towns and stuff, which can be less, less relaxing because you're close quarters where the zombies are. And, uh, I entered a church. And, um, there was a zombie just laying on the ground because they're not just standing up. They could be laying on the ground. And uh, I didn't see it at all until they made the zombie noise and uh, stood up and scared the crap out of me. Like, I, like, screamed. I was, uh... So sometimes I'll, um... I'll sit in Discord voice channel and stream the game I'm playing just, just to hang out, basically, more or less. And uh, we had a few people in there. And I screamed. I was like, rip. <laughs> it's come a long way, had a ton of bugs early on, but it's got much better. Yeah, I'm glad I didn't like, you know, start the game when it was like super early because I probably wouldn't have liked it as much. But playing it right now, I mean, there are definitely still bugs. Like, don't get me wrong, it's a little bit glitchy. But, uh,. Definitely hear a dude here. Venom up. Venom up. Um, definitely glitchy, glitchy and uh, buggy, but nothing uh, is a deal breaker so far for me in the game. <laughs> Wreck. I think it's the stopping power. Uh, but yeah, nothing is like deal breaker so far in the game for me. And uh, I'm kind of looking at it a, as a uh, serious... Um, whoa, what's happening? Uh, like a serious IRL simulator. So there's peeing, there's eating, there's defecating. There is... What are they saying? Um, there's a lot of stuff. And I find it to be... Fun and interesting. So I'm like pretty distracted because I don't know what's happening right now in the game. Wing wangs, dongs. I prefer wing wangs. Okay, it's happening. Let's see what's happening here. Alert, containment protocol level four active. Please take shelter immediately. So I wonder if I'm safe, like right here. Probably, okay. I'm not in the circle. Okay, what's happening? Anything? Nothing. Nothing's happening so far.
Okay, maybe nothing. Uh huh. Okay, I'm gonna go shopping then. I mean, I said take shelter immediately. I was expecting something to immediately happen. And nothing happened. Satch! I'm much confused about that one. Yeah, I was felt like there was something that was gonna happen, but I guess not. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Your guess is as good as mine, but 3 p.m. I think is uh. Well, of course it's right here. Shit. I was actually just gonna buy one, but if it's right here, I'll probably die. But, uh, yeah, 3 p.m. is, uh, supposedly when the event is gonna happen. So I think just building up to that event? I don't know. Aha, got it. Run. Run and or camp this. Maybe we'll just camp this. Oh, there's nothing in the camp because it's gone already because I took it. Hmm. I guess in the solo, only one person can take it. And then it goes away. Well, like I said, maybe I'll, I'll just kind of camp up here and uh, wait to see what that means. Maybe it means nothing. I'll, I don't know. Really? It will not let me jump up here. It's bullshit. Oh, there we go. Looks like it's in the plane. Should be safe. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, there's still six. It didn't change. Two satchels. Nice. We can go to storage. I guess. Kind of far. Might die on the way. Guess he doesn't want to play. Oh, there he is. Let 
this way. The reaction time, though. That's a little. Surely he knows where I am by now, right? Yeah, he does. Bye. See ya. Hopefully he doesn't have revives so I can get there in time. Oh, he didn't die yet. Probably has a revive. He didn't die, right? Welcome back, pickle dicks. See if I can grab this recon. Oh shit, it's in the building. Oh no, I can't get in there. Shit. Okay, rip. Contracting. What? Wait. Hey guys, I'm back. So loud in the house. I'm working outside on my front porch. Contractors are prepping to tile floor. Ooh. Okay, that guy definitely didn't die, I think. get over there that must be gotta go this is a different building actually Oh shit, that scared the crap out of me. He was on the roof. Different guy. Oh my god. <laughs> oh man, GG on that one. <laughs> I did not expect that. I didn't even see them. Ah, oh, man. Rip. Also, my ear is starting to hurt. Um, alright. I'm gonna... Mega Lurk. GG. We're definitely not going to make the battle pass this time, unfortunately. There's only 10 hours left. 
I'm not gonna make uh, like 34 levels, but I did just get the Wonder CP, perfect, so I can use that on stuff. This gun would have been really cool to get though. Uh, I really wish I got that. 95. I'm not gonna make 30 levels in 10 hours, unfortunately. Which gun is this? Check the internets for some crazy insane XP cheese. Like the best way to get XP. I think the easiest, the best way to get XP is play, actually play uh, multiplayer. So then you get more kills. The more kills you get, the um, faster your battle pass XP goes. through as many daily and officer challenges as possible so the challenges are these daily challenges here all right i mean i can do that six by six munition box i can do those or is that character xp or is that battle pass xp because i want battle pass xp i don't know but i'm gonna go to the bathroom I will be right back and I'm gonna run a ad for you guys. I will be right back in a minute.
Alright, here we go. My ears are already hurting from these earbuds, but they never uh, fit quite right anyway, I think. I might switch back to my headphones for the rest of the stream. Rip. Thanks to the Hydrate Castle. Little P walking on air in the background. Oh, is she? Oh, probably. Hi, Little P. <laughs> Thanks to the Hydrate Castle. He's the best. I wish you guys could see her in real life. I wish you guys could pet her. She's the best and give her treats. She's really the sweetest cat I've ever met. Ever. She's such a talker. She sure is. Right, Loki? Two thirty-nine. We got twenty minutes left until the nuke event. Depending on how long I stay in this round, we might see it happen in this. Uh, wait. What was the daily challenges? Oh no, it didn't show me. Pretty sure it was. Uh, oh, here it is. Uh, boneyard. Okay, we'll go to boneyard. You gotta buy six munition boxes as well. Okay. Oh yeah, it's pretty far. That's right. We'll do it. Let's go. I remember back when when Castle and I would drop Boneyard every time. Check it out, Castle. Look at the map. It's got red circles all over it. Those are gas parts. I don't think you're supposed to, you, you can't play in it basically. Gas parts, look at the circles. Those are, there. there's gas in it. If you're in it, it kills your health. It lowers your health. I think it's part of the nuke event that's happening at three o'clock. Yes. It's gas. Like being outside of the circle? Yeah, something like that. It's not the same kind of gas, though. But yeah, similar. It's like nuclear stuff. Like, I don't know if it's gas, like the circle gas. Something different. The zombies are up in the dam now. Enemy 
team is tracking your position. Perfect. Let's go. GG. A dead silence. Putting in work. Shit, we gotta secure this box, we're screwed. Emergency broadcast system. Happening in 16 minutes, boys and girls. I'm out of here, though. I don't want any part of that truck. I want to go to that shopping, though right here may as well oh 10,000 I need 2200 no I don't have enough all right Oh, we got 10,000. Let's go. The gas is here, though. Run, shit, no. It is moving. Enemy UAV overhead. Enemy UAV overhead. Unless I can find a vehicle. Pretty much can't use that loadout. Oh shit, sniper. GTFO.
Gas inbound. Safe zone relocated. Enemy UAV overhead. Pretty sure someone just flew in. Someone in the building, too. Let's go! Someone on that roof right here. Come on, bro. I can't believe we missed the shots. Oh shit, there's two people here. I think they're fighting each other. They are. Oh my god, I missed all those shots. go oh god oh no rock ah oh. oh, i didn't expect there to be a second guy like an idiot and i got stuck on the rock oh my god rip 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 you're up next mate get ready Rock was the best player that round, right? <laughs> it uh defended and offended. It did both. Listen up, soldier. Win here and you return to <sighs> But if you lose, you're done. Sort them out or capture the objective. Let's go. I don't really have anywhere to go. It's quarry. Quarry. This might be a decent area to land. Um, because I saw those, um, all these things, the bounty things and stuff. I was hoping that that meant uh, not a lot of people have been through here. Okay. 
Marksen geh. That's a far supply run. Enemy UAV overhead. Okay, that is just not a good place to be. So we're probably not going to that. That's just in the middle of the map. And we're already late to the circle. Oh my god, rip. All right, so 2.55, so we need to get back into a game right now so we can see the nuke event, so let's go. So it's supposed to be 3 p.m. Eastern, where whatever this thing is supposed to happen, so let's jump right back into a game immediately. What do you guys think is going to happen? They said, uh, I think, actually no, they said um, there's going to be a new mid-80s uh, ushered map, like, uh, ushered in. Mid-80s map ushered in. English words. Nuketown? <laughs> My, I was thinking Miami, to be honest, because it's a 1980s, but just because the Miami map is very 1980s. Let's see what happens. Hopefully we're doing it right, and it's just the regular uh, Verdansk, like you can see it in Solo, hopefully. Nuketown Miami edition. It might be pretty dope. I love, uh, I like Miami and I like Nuketown. Got two minutes on my clock for this to happen. Let's go. Battle Royale. Oh, uh, hangar? 
suggest you get moving. Mark the DC. Maybe go on train. We might die immediately though. Let's play it safe. I think we're gonna play it safe and go to the airport hangars, because I know that area. Usually die pretty quickly on the train, so I'm gonna just not. Because I don't wanna risk missing missing uh, the um the thing at three. Oh shit, no! Rip! I see that red crate up there. All right, lads, let's get it done. Head in this way. Moving. And dubs? No dubs. Which we usually try to play for kills mostly. So we play uh, kind of aggressively. I mean, I'm pretty bad, but uh, I'm pretty sure uh, dubs are few and far between here. <laughs> mostly, I'm just learning how to play aggressively. Um, so then when we do get in fights, we can, uh, murder, murder fools. Alright, so we can't go there. Let's go to the airport, I guess. How do I unping this? There we go. Nope. It's three o'clock, nothing's happening. I wonder if it begins at three. Enemy soldier incoming. Okay, so it's three o'clock and I just made that announcement. I don't know if anything's happened. Your guess is as good as mine. Yes, Castle, I see the alert. But I don't necessarily think it means go to an actual underground shelter. I mean, maybe it does, but it's not uh, clear to me. That's what that means. I feel like just stay away from those things, but I mean, I could go inside the underground that's across the airport. Plus, it's not Newcastle that's been happening. It's not the first time it's there. Mark the target. That alert. God, so many machine guns. I don't want. Uh, I don't want LMGs. All right, I'm gonna have out snipe this guy, but I'm down one armor as it is. We're screwed here. Hit him though. Maybe that'll scare him off a little bit. Cracked. Let's go. Scare him off.
Marked a target. Okay, so he went in there. Oh my god, everything's an LNG. Alright, good. Alright, well, we got an armor now. So what the hell happened at three? Nothing. It's uh nothing. I just I just uh, hope we can stay alive long enough to know what happens. Know what I'm saying? Mark some gear. That was the update, just a little alert message. You're welcome. Great. <laughs> I wonder if that guy's still in the tower. Probably, right? Okay, definitely not going there. Tower dude's brought up there. Years worth of work down the drain. Great. Gas is inbound. Marking you safe zone. Okay, I have to go anyway though. Wonder if something actually happens is gonna happen or something is going to happen starting at three. Care package marked. Oh, well, we're just gonna go there. Uh, in before safe zone is mixed down. Great. Perfect. Low P, you gotta go. You gotta go. I'm sorry, Low P. You gotta go or you gotta stay in the very red right corner. Or on my left side, that's fine too. We're gonna die. So I knew there was like definitely a dude underground. I saw him fly in my damn self. I guess the tower dude moved. He got scared. Rip. I mean, someone was already here. I see the roof guy. Ah, uh, this is not safe. Okay, I'm running. I saw those two guys over there. Not safe at all. I don't have a smart play or anything, so I'm just gonna GTFO out of there. Is this a new Warzone event? I think it's starting now. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess so. I mean, I don't really know. I know it's supposed to start at three. I haven't seen anything happen. I've been in the game before 3, and it's past 3 now. Like I said, I don't know what's supposed to happen.
You're supposed to queue into the event. Okay, well, we didn't queue into the event, so I guess this is not it. Enemy UAV Weird. I didn't see the quote new event, so I guess after this game, I'll have to, to see. I don't know. But thanks for letting me know, um, Lee. Appreciate that. And not thanks Call of Duty for not telling me. Thanks a lot. Thanks not a lot. There was definitely a guy at the roof. I see shot at me. I think it only lasts a few Enemy hours. Um, I mean, that's fine. We'll queue into that as soon as we're done here with this round. <sighs> okay. Vendor marked. Vendor marked. Lurk? Alright, thanks, man. Let's say, what is this? Oh, okay, airstrike. I don't have a lot of money, though. I don't even have enough for a UAV rip. Let me jump up there. It's bullshit. Okay, so that guy was basically just camping. That was a different guy. Can I grab the blue box? I hope so. Alright. Oh, we're out of here.
Another satchel. I mean, I'm kind of late to the game again, but this area would probably be the best. See if I can rotate. Okay, I still do want to roof to rotate though. There's probably a guy in this building. Definitely a guy built in this building. Friendly recon's online. Yep, it's up top. Oh to god, holy shit, Jesus Christ, he dropped that prox, how smart. Take his procs. Oh, I have enough. Do I have enough money for shit? UAV. Yes. GG. GG. Still want to rotate up though, still. Surely there's people in this bunker right now, right? Right on the edge to you. We don't have dead silence. Gotta move. Saw a guy right there. Oh, 
God. Should have kept my sniper out. Ah, GG. All right, let's get up for that event and see what that event's all about. There is a playlist update available. The playlist update will not be downloaded. Perfect. Ow. The Destruction of Verdansk Part 1. There is only one playlist. Let's do this. All right, see what this is about. I'm ready. My body is ready. Verdansk has passed the point of no return. Attempts to contain the outbreak have failed. Going back is not an option. <clears throat> it's every squad for itself and its new limited time mode. The only objective, survive. Drop in fast, the end is near. Wonder if that means uh, there's gonna be a new uh, war zone map. That's kind of like the rumor that they were gonna nuke uh, Verdansk and uh, bring in a new map. That was kind of the hope. Well, the hope was uh, the zombies take over the whole map and then they uh, need to bring in a new map, like nuke it or something, right? But the, uh, but the zombies didn't take over everywhere. They just kind of migrated like, like the same small, just one area of the map and kept migrating. So let's see what this is like. Oh, it's a team trio, apparently. Hey guys, what's going on? Nothing. Cool. Dope. Oh, it's a four man. Okay, squad. Yo, what's going on, Joke? How's it going, Joke? Hope you're having a great day, dude. Playtime's over, mate. You're going to the war zone. Enemy soldier incoming. Workday's almost over. Sweet. Awesome. Excuse me. It's so quiet. The game is normally super duper loud here. They managed to screw it up. Is this a new Division 2 update? It is not. Because there ain't no Division 2 update. Squad leader has jumped. Okay, well. I'm gonna fix the uh, sound in a second. But oh no, it's loud again. Okay, where are we going? All right, we're gonna land here then. So everyone just got shotguns? Okay, look, there's a lot of places here. A lot of places that got red circles on it. Too many 
Shotguns only. Huh. Well, I don't understand what's happening. Game's very quiet too. I think their update effed it up. Allied cluster strike inbound. Enemy dropping into the AO. Allied cluster strike inbound. How did I get down? Oh, I got gassed. What the hell just flew in? Oh, it's a dude. Oh, it's a zombie. Eliminate humans. Oh, now I'm a zombie. Oh, this is weird. Should I like eliminate my teammates? This is weird. Oh, stop humans before they exfil. Huh. I, since I died as a human, I am a zombie now. And I can do like stuff that you can't see on my screen because I'm blocking it. But I can charge jump, I can gas grenade, I can EMP blast. And that's my charge jump that I'm just doing. I don't know if, can I kill my teammate? Like, is my teammate part of it? Be Friendly precision airstrike inbound. Like, there's one dude on our team that's still, um... Alive, as a human. This person is like... Oh, we're all stopped. I don't- I don't get it. We're all like- Is this like, game broken or what? Like, we're all frozen. I can't charge jump, I can't do anything other than, like, move. Server disconnect. Server overloaded. Lost connection. Wow, this is amazing update. This is so good. That was, like, literally the best update I've ever seen from Call of Duty. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Can we just get back to uh, Warzone, please? Kind of just want to play regular Warzone. The dam is the last place. This is Pretty small company, give them a break. Uh huh. Uh huh. How long is this gonna even be? I don't know, Lee was saying um, a few hours, something. I mean, if it's a few hours, I'm not gonna be playing this, right? So I just kind of want to see what happened. I'll try it again one more time, but pretty much, I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna switch to uh, Scum soon. Cause I don't, 
care about this mode. It does not seem fun. <laughs> My question is, when is just the new map? Like, just can we just get the new map, though? Oh, there's several events. Event one is one to th is three to five p.m. Oh, they're all the same day. No, wait, they uh, roll into tomorrow too. Yeah, just don't, do not get in a vehicle. They will not be fucked up. Well, they, yeah, they really screw up the sound because the airplane is really the loudest every single time, usually. It is a quick fucking game. It's gone. It's so quiet. You don't want to go anywhere near maybe get a bag. Well, he already jumped, so. I like how none of these people, like, fly together. Probably just want to stay in the air as, that, as long as possible. As soon as people start dying, shit gets So tomorrow is also going to be 3 to 12 a.m. to p.m. Wait, what? Oh, 12 a.m. to 3 p.m. So basically, don't play it today and tomorrow if you don't care about this, it sounds like. Whoopee, come here. Next, it seems like players are going to have to update their games around 12 a.m. tomorrow, so tonight. Finally, it seems like Raven expects everything to be normal by 3 p.m. tomorrow. Oh, okay. What's the point of hiding? Right, there's a zombie right here. There's a zombie right here. Where's that sound? Uh, like this mode doesn't even make sense. Yeah, it doesn't. I don't understand what's happening. So this guy's running away from the juggernaut, but then I—I I, I mean, the juggernaut's gonna be hard to kill, and we only have shotguns, right? So I get that, but like, what else are we gonna do then? I don't understand what. His objective is. I can't hear shit. 
What the hell he's saying? Those things are just like attracted to I hate that I only have this gun, but forty-eight rounds. He's very low. Like extremely low volume. So like okay. Gonna have to move. Enemy juggernauts! No, they're not enemies, my guy. The zombies are enemies. Dude, I'm just tagging <laughs> them. Not too, the zombies just like it is like fucking havoc, bro. Okay, Juggernaut in the regular Warzone game is like a heavy duty suit with shield and like zombies just like fly into it. and like a crazy gun, right? Oh my god, here's a zombie flying right here. Going after the car. Yep, it's right here. So watch, just, 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 just chill, man. We're on to the last one to survive. They can't. They see us, but we. Here they are. Wow. Oh no. Oh, I fucking saved your life. It's a vehicle. Uh huh. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> He's not even trying to kill us, dude. Please don't kill us. Please don't. He got kill out. Us. I know, but I think he's just trying to stay alive too. I understand. Right. Oh come on, man! Really? What? All right, we gotta go. Yeah. Shit. Oh. I don't understand this guy's strategy. Okay, so now I'm a zombie. Fine. And I apparently cannot jump over things? Okay, there we go. Does the gas matter to me, I wonder? Oh, he killed me. Charge jump. Let's go after this, like, it says Juggernaut right here. <laughs> like, was I supposed to be, were friends? Like, I don't understand. Like, he obviously killed me, so I guess not, right? But. Like all those charge jump things that people are seeing, those are all zombies. And we're supposed to kill humans, that's our goal now, but there's one guy right here somewhere. No. No. How did I even die just now? You just punched me? Like who? Oh my god. Alright, let's see what this is. Commander, I regret to inform you that Verdansk has fallen. Containment protocol has been initiated. Three, two, one.
kaboom. Go. Oh. Goodbye, Verdansk. Get rid of it. Okay. What happened? Congratulations on completing the destruction of Verdansk Part 1. To celebrate, we are rewarding you this calling card that I don't give two shits about. Perfect. Great. All right. This is stupid. Um, okay. <laughs> what? Okay, so let's see. When's the second event? Event two. Like, I don't even know how I completed it. Like, what did I even do? I, I died and I didn't kill anyone as a zombie. So what did I do? Maybe that means um, we, we as a collective zombie collective, uh, killed all the humans. So then that completed that. Or something. Let's see. Aoi says event two is 5 p.m. Eastern. Five PM Eastern to twelve AM, so tonight. So if I play again, if I try again tonight. That's event two. And tomorrow, twelve AM to three PM, so during the day, that's event three. And then tomorrow again is event four, three PM to four PM. So basically anytime I play tonight. Tomorrow during the day and tomorrow in the afternoon, three to four. Uh, stuff is gonna happen. I don't know. That was super weird. I don't even know what to say about it. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about that. Um, in the meantime, I'm gonna go to the bathroom and uh, I think we'll load up scum when I get back because I am not playing that today, right now, on stream at least, because that was stupid. But I do want to see the other events, uh, if anything, just to collect the stupid calling cards I don't care about. So, I don't know. I will be right back. I'm just gonna run to the bathroom.
All right, we're back, guys. We are going to quit Call of Duty. We're gonna switch over. To scum. Thanks, JJ. Where are you playing, JJ? I thought you were playing, um... I think I said you were playing Diablo. Dream Daddy next. <laughs> no, probably not. Definitely not. Tropico. All right, so disclaimer, I have about 8.8 .8 hours playtime in the game. So I'm pretty new at the game. Uh, but feel free to, if you don't know anything about the game, feel free to ask questions and either I will be able to answer your questions or uh, we'll look it up together. Or figure it out together, rather. I was till I forgot I had launched it and probably locked out. Nice. <laughs> so you're going to be the scum of the earth. I mean, yeah, basically because I'm uh, it's an I'm an inmate in the game, right? So yeah, I guess it's actually uh, the place is called Scum Island. So maybe that also means uh, scum of the earth too for the inmates. Right, I'm changing my Twitch title game category stuff. So, you know, what's funny is uh, I was uh, updating the list of games and stuff I play on my Twitch like profile, whatever, and uh, it, I typed in scum and it would not let me save my profile with the word, the name scum in it. That was kind of annoying, actually. Alright, uh, title of the game should be updated now. To the appropriate stuff. So I've not streamed this game before, not even done. I've never even had a uh, test stream on this game. So let me know if you see, if you guys see anything weird happening with the game or sounds are loud, not loud enough uh, or something. I, I'm gonna guess that the sounds, there aren't gonna be a lot of sounds, um, but uh, I'm gonna do a couple of things first. So this is my character. Welcome to seeing my character. There it is. There he is. I'm wearing inmate pants. Like a jumpsuit pants, basically. And I don't know why my belt is showing through my shirt. That's kind of weird. I got reindeer um, headband. And the, uh, what is it? The plague doctor mask. Which is also kind of weird. Call of Duty Modern Scum. Yep. Exactly. Exactly. Um, okay. There it goes, sliding off the screen again. Whoops, where'd it go? questions, how to do stuff, what I'm doing, etc. And, uh, yep. Let's, uh, jump right in. Um, so there's a lot of data in the game, which is quite interesting because I don't like to read. 
um, it shows you like your heart rate, like it's a, there's a tab called metabolism, I think. So there's like your heart rate, um, your temperature, your running endurance, your hunger level, your thirst level and all of that stuff. Oh, we're gonna kill the music actually. Uh, oh wow, this game. Uh, let's see, I might turn the sounds up, but I don't have any sounds really. The sounds are very, um, quiet, because it's very, it's like ambient sounds, basically like environment sounds, not ambient, environment sounds. So it's not very loud to begin with. Until you hear zombies. And they scare the crap out of you. So I bet you my uh, my keyboard sound is probably louder than game sounds. Huh, it's so quiet. Okay, let me see if I can turn up. Actually, I feel like when I play the game sounds are pretty low too. But I never changed them though. Um, uh, okay. Let's see. And yeah, it's, they're all 100% already, though. Oh, I can go more. Okay. Master sound intensity. Oh, no. That's the highest you can go. Whip. Rip. Okay, never mind. <laughs> uh... Uh, I want to get outside and do some stuff so to see how loud things are. You like my red antlers? Thanks, Castle. So there's a lot of searching for stuff. And I wish I could like stack these, but I can't. Um, there's a lot of, there's gonna be a lot of searching for stuff. Oh, can I eat this? Oh, I can. Okay. So this is your inventory. It's, uh, there's a lot of stuff. Um, there's a lot of stuff there. Um, inventory is wonky as heck. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't say it's like, it's definitely not beautiful. I know Castle is being sarcastic, but I mean, there's a lot of stuff. Like, it's very similar to like Tarkov. For example, I would say. Um, there's just a lot of stuff and you need to drag things around. So, I mean, I don't love the uh, UI, but it's fine. I can work with it. So, that's just my inventory. So, I'm wearing all these clothes here in this column here. And this is the stuff that's in my backpack. I have a hiking backpack now, thank God. And you got pockets for your tactical jacket. Shirt only has two pockets. I have a leather belt, belt, pistol holster, but I don't have a gun yet. And uh, I just have a knife in my in my pants. And this is the crafting menu, which is just as crazy. Um, now, I normally don't like crafting games. Um, unless it's easy crafting. So, like, something, for example, like Minecraft is kind of difficult for me to craft. Because they don't exactly tell you <clears throat> uh, what you need to craft, I think. It's like, it's just not intuitive for me. Not to say that this game is going to be intuitive, but... Um, well, say, for example, if I wanted to make this stone knife, you click it. It tells you over here on the left what you need. And at first, I didn't realize that there were these two little arrows under the actual object. And it just means that you have options of what components you want to use. Like, this is a small stone, and this is a big stone. I had no idea that this arrow existed. 
So I thought it was whatever it showed you, that's what you needed to, to have in order to craft that item. Now, this uh, gear, kind of green gear icon on the left corner here with the one, I don't know what that means. I'm not sure what that means. But I need two small or big stones in order to craft the stone knife. So, and there's other stuff uh, like this one, dildo spear, which is kind of funny, kind of weird. And it's like one of the components is this? It's like, where the hell am I going to find that? I don't really know. I don't really know. But um, you can also take all your clothes off. Uh, well, you need to take your clothes off sometimes to craft like rags and stuff like that, which you can use to uh, patch wounds and stuff. Which is interesting. Um, Minecraft can show you what you need to. I'm not a big crafter either. I think it does show you, but, um, I don't know. I felt like Minecraft just, it was a lot harder to craft stuff for some reason. I don't really know. So I always ended up playing in the, um, creative mode. Hey, Nikki Poo. I'm new to this game too. Nice. How many hours do you have in this game? I have less than 10. I've only played it for like a couple days, probably. About eight? Okay, so we were about the same. Um, I'm just playing on single player mode. I have joined a server that a friend is on, but we're not on it. We are just doing single player right now. Uh, my goal here is to find a vehicle in this town. Like, what happened yesterday was really funny, actually. Uh, so I'm this little red circle here. I uh, I was in this city here before. We're on the A4 grid, like here, where my mouse is. That's where I was before. I was trying to find a vehicle there, didn't. And then I came down here, looked for one, didn't find one. So I decided to go over here to where I am now. And uh, as soon as I arrived uh, into the town, I got killed. It took me about, like after basically two or three hours of trekking over there, you know, like looting stuff, working on whatever. It took me like two or three hours to get there and I died as soon as I got here. Like a zombie killed me, I was fighting him and I died. Cause my health was already super low, right? It was like, already, it was at like 12%, which is really, really low. And uh, my vision was blurry. Oh, rice, Uncle Pong rice. Great, can I eat this probably? And uh, as soon as I got here, I like called it before I got into town. I was like, I'm gonna get here and I'm gonna get killed by a zombie. And yep, that happened. So then what happened was I respawned at um, a random location. And then I, I was able to make it back to my dead body and then pick up all my gear again. So I picked up all my gear and I looted some of these houses already. And uh, that's where I left off last night. And uh, this is where we are now. So just to kind of keep you guys situated of uh, what happened recently. That's what happened recently. I've been searching for a vehicle for three days. I played, couldn't find one. Oh, that reminds me. I need to pull up some maps. Um, <clears throat> some people might think they're cheater maps, but honestly, I don't think they're cheater maps because it's not going to help me win in this game. All it's really doing is making my life a lot easier. So let me go ahead and pull out these maps. And uh, Nikki Poo, do you use any of these like maps that show you where loot is basically? Uh, or where police stations are or where there are possible vehicle spawns? And if you don't know what I'm talking about, I will pull it up on my screen. Cause I'm gonna load them up right now already, anyway. I looked at a couple, but not sure what one to use. Cheater. Okay, I uh, will load some up right now. So there's two that uh, my friend was telling me about. Give me all the cheats. Um, so this one is scum.online slash scum map. I don't know that I love this one. I think this one tells me, shows me the bunkers though. And the bunkers are obviously where you're, gonna be, where you're gonna be able to find the dope shit, right? Like guns and stuff, probably. 
So let's see. We are. <clears throat> where are we? Where are we? Hold on. Okay, we're. We're in A3. Okay. Oh, we got some bunkers nearby ish. Okay. So we're. We're here. We're in this town. This town right here. Um, so there's a bunker actually along the road that I might actually go check out and hopefully get a gun. I have uh, two different types of ammos right now, but I don't have any guns. So I, I think I have some 12-gauge uh, slugs or something and something else. Uh, but I haven't seen one single gun yet. And by the way, this is the only game I've ever played for like this long consecutively, hours-wise, without shooting anything. So this is like kind of a miracle that I really like this game. Just so you guys know. Um, Alright, so I would like to loot the rest of this town um, and then head over to that bunker. So that's what we're gonna do. All these uh, cabinets and stuff are searchable. They may not have stuff, but they're all searchable. And uh, houses might have zombies in it, so. So bold check strategy, corners. God. Let's God. see if it pays off for us. Uh, check, uh, check corners. And stuff. Bold strategy. It is a bold strategy. So um, they're abandoned vehicles, but those uh, don't work obviously because it's abandoned. But they might have stuff in it. And you also have to like drink, eat, pee, and stuff like that in this game. Which is interesting. So this is basically like real life simulator. So you got like heart rate, you got other stuff that I have no idea what they are. Uh, you got temperature. You can run a fever apparently. Um, this is like the crazy view right here, the metabolism view. Like on the right here, you can see how much calorie intake you're taking in what your calorie intake is and what your calorie outtake is. Uh, you can see all your vitamins and like how much fiber you got. You can see how full your colon is, how full your bladder is. There's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of stuff. We're in starvation phase four, which is uh, not good. So probably just want to find food. And if I find food, eat it. I can barely keep a real me alive. Virtual me is totally screwed. Well, at least then you can live vicariously through uh, my character. I don't know. Hopefully. Hopefully you find, uh, you guys will find this stuff uh, possibly interesting. Just kind of maybe like a different, different thing to do. Different, different kind of game than we usually uh, play, you know. Change of pace. I like how detailed it is, and supposedly soon it is going to come more in play. Yeah, like, the detailedness is really interesting to me. I feel like it's really unique. And the game looks amazing. And I really wish that I uh, knew how to do um, photo mode in this game. I don't think it's a- th I don't think it's available. And- oh yeah, this is a- uh, this is beta, by the way, guys. And by beta, this game has been in beta for, like, I don't know, two years or something. So you're gonna see glitches, you're gonna see bugs. It's not perfect. Um, ooh, we got more ammo. We got more ammo. So yeah, this is not as polished as the normal games we usually play, which are like, you know, triple A titles. So this is definitely an experience for me, as well as for you guys to watch. Polished like cyberpunk. I didn't play cyberpunk, but yeah, I heard it was a hot mess. <laughs> so I know there is a water fountain somewhere because I used it. I don't know where it is though. You play EFT too? Um, I recently started that as well. I like bought it 
and never really played it. Played it once and that was it. But um, I did play a bunch of it last weekend. Um, how about yourself, Nikki Poo? Gunpowder seems like something I would want. I feel like. Let's uh, swig some beer. I've heard that you should just um, drink and eat as you come across things. So that's sort of what we're doing here. Uh, we don't have any room for this, do we? Crap. You can also rotate items so that it fits better. Um, uh, you can't put your beer in your pistol holster. Okay, fine. Oh, I can eat uh, bread. If you eat too much, you throw up. Which I have done. I ate a whole ton of aloe vera last night and like um, olives and stuff like that. Thanks for the hydrate, Pro Show. <clears throat> uh, I played a lot of EFT. I took a break a couple weeks ago, and that was when I found this game. Oh, cool. Yeah, I uh, I only I've only played one map. Um, Nikki Poo, and it's only been the offline mode too, just because, uh, the offline raid, because I've been just been practicing, just like learning the map, which I think is probably the most important thing in the game, other than shooting, obviously. Um, so I was, I haven't played, uh, online with that in, uh, EFT yet. Bro. Alright, I'm gonna dump this in glue. Now can we fit that? Yes. Okay. Back from interview, short break, next one. How did the how did the first interview go? Uh the Warzone event was stupid, so just be glad that you missed it. <laughs> um it was some weird zombie thing. Like you're like as humans, like AK when you first spawn in, everyone's a human. So then uh, your goal as a human is supposed to exfil out of the area. And then if you die, you become a zombie. And as a zombie, your goal was to uh, kill the humans. And that was it. And uh, we did complete it somehow, and I don't know how we completed it, but we completed it. And uh, you saw like the nuke thing coming out of the ground or whatever, and that was it. And then I got a stupid calling card that I don't care about. So, here we are. Speaking of beautiful aloe, we'll eat some of these bad boys. So if I go into metabolism, um, I can see the digestion stuff, which you guys can't really see because I'm blocking you. But it's fine. You don't need to see it. But it counts down like it's like it counts up actually how much uh stuff how much uh, of the Uncle Pong rice that we digested and the bread we ate and the aloe we just ate. Uh, can I stack these? No. Okay. If I remember, aloe will cover hunger and thirst. Uh, yeah, I don't remember. It will do definitely do something. Uh, for either one of those. Um, but it also heals burns and bruises. And it really kept me alive last night. Like, it, it increased my health. And I really needed it. Alright. Oh my god, I'm running out of room. I'm, like, hoarding everything. You guys surprised? I'm hoarding everything. Um, uh, okay, I don't want this one to drop. I'd rather have the soda, probably. Alright, I always do want to stick out, though, in case uh, zombies show up. Posh check? Alright. 
Oof. Thanks, Abby. Alright, search. No safety pin. Okay. I want to see if I can find that fountain. Um, so last night I finished a bottle of like carrot juice or whatever, some kind of juice. And uh, I finished it, it was empty. And it said that I could fill it. And then I filled it and I drank out of it. And honestly, I don't know what I filled it with. As soon as I started drinking it though, after filling it, I feel like I could have filled it probably with urine. That's probably what happened. But I don't know, and I don't know how to confirm, so I don't know. Can hoard more if you have base? That's true. Yeah, I don't have a base yet. So I'm playing in single player right now, and I don't have a base. But I want to find a vehicle first, and then start a base somewhere. Because if I have a vehicle, then I can get away from the town if I wanted to, which I probably want to, I guess. I well, have to, but I think I want to. So my first goal is to, well, stay alive, but also to find a vehicle. And I believe I saw on that other map, let me get in here first, probably, hopefully it's safe in here. So on this other map, which I will pull up right now. So this map, um, you can filter by stuff such as vehicle spawns and um, it can show you where vehicles may be. So we are, where are we? We're here. So there's like 10 spawns, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There are 10 possible vehicle spawns. And this is a scum-map.com for Nikki Poo, if you're interested in that. Uh, so we have 10 possible chances, uh, or whatever I said, for getting a vehicle here. Um, I saw them at a different area too, possible chances, and I didn't find anything. <laughs> so, kind of hit or miss. Oh shit. Sounds like they're in the next house. Definitely in the next house, because I can't see him. Can you guys hear that? Or is that super low? The zombie growls. Can't hear it? Okay. I don't want to turn it up super loud, because if I get close to one, then it's going to be probably really loud. Okay, there's definitely multiple now, so might have to fight. Oh, I see it. It's downstairs. Oh my god! Holy crap. Oh god, shit. So if I had a gun, this would be a lot easier, but I don't, so I gotta use the spear. And usually they just drop clothing, which is pretty much ruined, and there is... Uh, like a health thing for clothing like six percent six percent six percent it's basically trash so I could just leave it I usually don't even check but sometimes it's nice to check just uh, in case because they might have other stuff oh shit this one's fast oh. the best technique is kind of time it because they kind of lunge at you so if you back up as you poke them kind of your best chances yeah see they usually only drop close seven percent four percent four percent trash okay
This would be a lot more exciting if I had a vehicle for you guys to watch me drive around in, but alas, alas. There's also like um, servers that have PvP, like right now we're just playing PvE, so it's just us against, um, well, it's me against um, zombies. And by that, because I'm playing solo, so I don't have like a teammate or anything, it's just me. So I feel like for the majority of this game, it's like pretty relaxing. Because for the majority of the time, I'm not fighting anything. Can you show me your settings so I can adjust mine? What's wrong with your settings? Um, search force. And how's it going, dude? Hope you're having a good day. Can't get mine right? Uh, I can show you. Like, what do you... Like, that's a drone out there. If you guys can hear that sound. Um, like, what's wrong with, uh... What's wrong with your game? Like, what do you... What options do you want to see? Exactly. I'm doing well. Thank you. Thank you for asking, Serge. Well, like, what stuff? Video? What's, uh, what kind of issues are you having? Uh, so I didn't really change much, by the way, guys. Uh, I did change the field of view, like, a lot. Especially for first-person view. Third-person's fine at 85 for me. Uh, but I didn't change any of these uh, quality settings. To show the top of the list, slowly lower to the bottom. Okay, so this is the top. Uh, I changed the field of view stuff. Uh, I didn't change anything on the graphics, basically. This is just whatever that was optimal settings for my computer. Which was basically looks like everything is epic, high, etc. I, like I said, I didn't change any of this stuff. I didn't even look at it. I figured I would just start the game and if anything was going to mess up, I would come in here and fix it. Um, I think there was something that I did change, but it's not in the video mode. It was like a motion blur thing or something. I was just wondering if I was doing something wrong. Hmm. Okay, well, hopefully that's all you needed to see. But like I said, I didn't really change anything settings wise hello hi this rose hip is that food rose hip also called rose haw and rose hep is the accessory fruit of the rose plant it's simply red to blah, 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 who cares whatever we can look like we can eat it we'll eat it Your graphics and gameplay speed are great, by the way. Thanks. I feel like there's so many things on the screen, but there are so many things on the screen. Um. All right, I haven't searched these houses yet. They look, the doors look unopened. Yeah, I, I feel like this game looks pretty amazing. Actually, I feel like my game's chugging a little bit, maybe. Um, so I may have to adjust settings myself, but... Actually, no, we've been here. I went to that before. Um, we went this way. Maybe we didn't go into this house. New mask? New mask?
I usually leave the doors open, so I don't think I've been through this house. More gunpowder. I wish we could stack. I don't even know what I can use gunpowder for. Like, can we use to make ammunition? Well, duh, but I don't know how to make ammunition, so I'm not sure how helpful that will be for me. But I could always drop stuff if I need more room. Oh my god, I'm so hungry. I can hear my stomach, like, growling. My real-life stomach. <laughs> it does not sound good. You could also, like, take a nap. Which, uh, apparently helps your health come back up. Also, um, this is the position I was in the other day, because I wanted to rest. But I was on the middle of the street, and uh, I was, like, taking my pants off so that uh, we could look at the, the willy warmer that I had in the game. I guess uh, if you play as a male character in the game, you you get the willy warmer uh, as, part of your, as part of your as part of your apparel. So I thought that was entertaining. See, it's tough to stay alive uh, in real life, let alone in a game. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. I know. I know. Oh, there's a, another level. What's this? Uh, I'm not gonna take that, because that's not edible. I probably don't want to drink vegetable oil. Oh shit, there's, an, there's a... Oh, it's a big one. <laughs> See if we can kill him in here. Your kitty cat's there? Yeah, she's here all the time. Her name is Ponyo. Call her little P. Oh god, it got hit. Uh, there we go. That's why my, my camera is angled that way, mostly, so that you guys can see her uh, sit on the mouse pad. Alright. Everything. Oh, they got gunpowder. Again. I don't really have much room. Cargo drop deployed, landing in two minutes, A3. Uh, okay, that's the sector I'm in. I think they always do that, don't they? Okay, we're gonna try to go for that uh, cargo drop, maybe. Um, I've never been to a cargo drop. I went to one yesterday and it was already about to explode, apparently. And I didn't know how to open it. But I think I know how to open it now. Because I think you use a crowbar to open stuff. To open the cargo drop, I mean. So we're gonna try that. But I don't know where it is until it lands, so we're gonna have to wait. <clears throat> Usually there's like green smoke when it lands. Starvation phase four still, so all right, we're gonna eat some more. stuff also uh surge um if you have enough channel points you could also give little p a uh snack through the channel rewards stuff fyi Mel. There's other stuff uh, in the rewards too, um, but I have most of the exercise stuff turned off right now because um, I'm kind of recovering, but there's other stuff in there too, if you are interested. Uh, nothing? Are these like, what are these? Like, grape? Grape vines? Probably not. I see the cargo drop. Oh, uh, it's to the... Okay, it's back this way. I came from here earlier. Alright, let's go. Let's go. I'm 
pretty sure the uh, cargo drop is there for about 20 minutes maybe. So hopefully we are able to make it there within 20 minutes of us running. We should be able to. I gotta watch out for endurance so I don't uh, tire myself out and I have to pant to breathe. So we're gonna do like a slow jog sprint thing. You can see on the bottom left um, that my running is at 50% my uh, endurance. Forty percent. My heart rate's going up now. It's at twenty five percent, so now it's going back up because I'm walking so slow. See if I had a vehicle then I wouldn't have to travel by foot anywhere. So I really want a vehicle. And probably after we go to this cargo drop, if we are still alive, uh, we'll probably go come back into this town again. And continue looking for a vehicle. Alright, this should be coming up soon. Up here. There's also like animals. Oh, I see the green smoke now. That's where the cargo drop is. There's also like uh, wild animals that could attack you. Uh, the first time I died uh, was shortly after I started the game and it was, I got killed by like a wolf. There's also apparently like mech warriors in this game. I think the mech warriors are in like the military base or something. I haven't been there yet, so I don't really know about that. I've heard about it only. But so far I've seen like um like pigs or hogs. Uh, I've also seen like um chickens. Uh wolves. And I've seen birds. Like crows and stuff. I haven't uh, been able to hunt anything yet cuz all I have is a spear so it's like really slow. Um there's also like larvae. Oh shit. Hey, it's like a donkey. Can I tame the donkey and ride it? Or do I just kill it? Like, what can I do here? Little pee. Please, 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 little pee. What can I do here with this? Is it a donkey? Or is it a horse? Do they have horse riding in this game? That would be dope. Hello, little donkey. It might even attack me. It sounds like a zombie, though. Maybe it's a zombie donkey? Aw. Aw. Come back. If I had a gun, I would have been able to kill it. But, alright, I'm just gonna forget it, because we're gonna waste time and not be able to get the cargo. I really want to get the cargo. Rip. Can't ride them? Gotcha, thanks. I really should have thrown the spear probably at it, but I was hoping that I could do something with it without killing it. I guess if you kill it, you probably do, um, cook the meat. I don't know how to do a fire or anything yet. Alright, here it is. Another donkey. I wonder why it's running. Like, is there a zombie over there, maybe? Alright, so I've never done this before. I heard that you can use like a crowbar. So, uh, that's what we're gonna try.
Yo, what's going on, Toxicity Rose? How's it going? Creepy Taco, what's going on, dude? Um, ow. Now, I don't know how to do this, though. Like, how do I do this? Does anyone know how? Let me equip this. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna leave my spear outside on this rock. And then I wanna move my crowbar thingy stuff. Here we go. Okay, don't forget it's there, guys. Um, okay. How do I do this? You guys can call me Rose Mail. I'm super new to the game. Yo, what's going on, Rose? How's it going? Thanks for being here. Um, forced unlock. Okay, cool. 13 and a half minutes left. Uh, I'm doing well, Tox. Uh, Rose, thanks for, thanks for asking. How are you doing? Hope you're doing well as well. Yeah, we're playing Scum, uh, Creepy Taco. This is our first stream of Scum, and uh, we only have less than, uh, I only have less than 10 hours in the game. I bought it a couple days ago, and I've been really enjoying the game. And uh, I figured it'd be something a little bit different. So hopefully you guys are all uh, enjoying this so far. Yo, what's going on, M? How's it going? How's it going? And also for all the new people, welcome. Thank you guys for being here. Uh, I usually stream a lot more shooty type games, so this is my first venture, more or less, into a non, not as shooty game. I usually do like first person shooters and third person shooters. I like survival games. Never heard of this one. Yeah, I don't really usually do survival games. So like, like I said, like this is totally more or less new to me. Um, so what just happened? Anything happen? Uh, give Ponyo a treat. All right, let me, hopefully no zombies get me. Goofy. Go open it now. Open where? Where do I open it? Come on, open it. Like, where, what, where's the door? You have to search it now? Um, okay. Um, okay, well, let me, f it's halfway through, so let me just finish this part, I guess. Whatever that means. Hey, what's going on? Uh, damned. How's it going, dude? Thanks for being here. Just hover over it and it'll give you the option to search. Okay. I guess I didn't see it when I hovered over, so there must be a specific area to hover over to see that option. I got 11 minutes to figure it out. Search. Oh, there's multiple doors and stuff. Okay, this is all beer. Oh, there's like this one too. Okay, so, okay, so I did one of the- I did this one. <gasps> Recurve bow. Alright, I gotta dump some of this shit out. Hold on. I'll put it right here. This- my stuff is gonna despawn though, I think, but let's, uh, I'm gonna drop some of this that I immediately do not need. Make some room. No, don't eat. Drop. Um... Carbon arrow. 
Interesting. Cool. Hat was worn. Don't care about the hat. Bow silencer. A silencer made for bows. What? Take some of these. Arm guard. Equip that. Animal skin quiver. Oh, it's too big. Can we equip it? Yes, we can. Um, wait, can we? Wait, no. Yes. Sweet. Nope. Whoa, look at that. Okay, cool. Uh, I don't want this hat, though. Okay. Oh, this, okay. We gotta keep doing more stuff. Um. Oh, no. Where did my crowbar go? I think I dropped my crowbar. Uh oh. Uh, I think it's out here. Okay. Um. Move this, get the crowbar. Uh, and thanks for that, damned. Thank you. Appreciate the help. I've been playing for two days, not a single backpack. Yo, it's super RNG. Yeah, I first, um, after a while, I finally found an assault backpack. And then the next day, as in yesterday, I found this hiking backpack. And it's so much better. It's got so much room. Beer is essential for survival. I mean, I can find beer. I'm pretty sure I have some in my backpack still. But I had multiple. I would be horrible. I'll need to carry everything. <clears throat> I mean, the game is the game is interesting. It's definitely interesting. I I've seen other people wear so much clothing and they're like super fat, but I think they do that so that it gives them more pockets to hold stuff. The drop will blow up and blow you up too. And the timer hits its end, I would leave and run as far away as you can at the one minute mark. Yeah, I I've seen it actually blow up. High five, Steve. -o. Yeah, I've seen it blow up, so I do know that it blows up. It will count down when there's 25 seconds left or something like that. So, we got time. Ish. I just hope no zombies come in. Because <clears throat> that would suck. I uh, playing online? No, I'm playing single player. <clears throat> I haven't, uh, haven't tried, uh, really, uh, in a server yet, just because I want to get used to basic mechanics first. Um, I did join a server, um, but I haven't played really yet on there. Uh, do you guys play, for the ones that do play Scum, do you guys play PvE only, or do you play PvP only, or play, like, a mix of both? I would like to try PvP, but I feel like right now, like, I don't have a gun, right? So I think, like, right now, it would be a moot point to do that, right? PvE only? I'm not ready for PvP. Yeah. PvE only. Okay. But also don't play much. I feel like... I mean, do a lot of people just play PvE then? And, and do you play on a server or are you just playing single player mode? Which is like offline, I assume. Oh, I want this mask. Why do I have extra shoes? Oh, I don't want these boots. So there's a lot of a lot of drinks up in here. I'm gonna go eat. All right, Serge. Have a good one. Thanks for being here. And don't forget to follow, guys, if you guys are interested uh, in more of this content. Smash that follow button, guys. Uh, I keep the knife in my pocket. Uh, I do keep 
I mean, it's just there. That's where I had it, I think. Oh no, I dropped my pants. Lol, right here. There we go. Well, I took those- Oh, I thought all those tights were gonna go under the pants. That's what happened. So my inmate pants had the knife still. That's what happened. I was confused. What happened there? Um... I got a lot of beer, but I don't have a lot of room. Do I even care about this? Can I put it here? I can. Gently aims your stomach, just like that newbie. I mean... So here's the thing, like, if you drink a lot of sugary drinks, um... It will make you fat. And you probably don't really want that, so that's why I'm gonna limit... Probably how much I'm drinking here. Uh, in terms of beer and sugary drinks. I just think PvP is more popular than PvE. I feel like it is too, like based on the server that I am currently on, not currently on, but uh, that I am a part of. Um, it looked like there were more PvP players. Six percent or crowbar is gonna die soon. No rip. Uh, use it for this last one, I guess. Three minutes left. You can become a tubby in this game? I think so. Like I think that probably means that you're going moving slower in the game. I don't really know though. Are you ready for Mortal Kombat Friday? Yes, I'm ready. I'm super ready. Mortal Kombat! Super ready. It's gonna be so good. I love Mortal Kombat. Game-wise and movie-wise. And just general martial arts badassery. <clears throat> My item got destroyed. No. No, I didn't even open it. <sighs> um, You can lockpick it, but I don't have anything else to lockpick. So I think, uh, I guess that's it then. I guess that's it. So like it shows you your saturated fat and your sodium and stuff. So you have to watch out. Like I got 31% fat right now. So if you drink a lot of soda and stuff, that's just not going to be good for you. But all right, that's it, I guess. It is going to make a kaboom. Um, so I got to grab some of my stuff and roll away from this area. I definitely feel like some of the stuff can be like a lot more intuitive than it actually is. But I mean, it's a beta and I don't know. Like I, it's none of it is um, deal breaker for me still. For whatever reason. Uh, metal pipe would be good to keep, but I don't have any room for the metal pipe. Alright, well, um... Holy shit, that's scary. First person view as well as third. What? What? I was super far enough away. Are you serious? Last time I was 
What? Last time I was that, about that far away. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Eat shit. Oh my god. <sighs> no, you need to prefer the not though. Yesterday, I, I, it blew up yesterday, and I wasn't that far away. Okay, the saving grace here is that I have enough FP, which is fame points, which is basically XP. You make it when you um, <laughs> when you um, play the game and do stuff, craft and stuff. So luckily we have just luckily enough to respawn in the same sector. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, do that. Did you have more stuff between you and the thing yesterday though? No, it was just in the woods. Like I felt like it was like about the same, but maybe I was a little closer, right? I don't really know. Uh, but definitely rip. Jesus Christ. Alright, so I think my stuff will despawn uh, after a certain point, so I gotta do this. Gotta find where it was. Um, um, I feel like I'm actually near where I was. Actually. What's going on, Wicked Truth? I feel like I'm like right here, right? Okay, definitely nearby. I feel like I'm a little bit this way though. No, 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 okay, this way. There was definitely a um a lake like that. So first I'm gonna make uh, a quick tool, like a defense tool first. Because if I don't, there's going to be zombies that are going to kill me, and let's just do this real quick, and then, let's see, we can grab stuff on the way, and you can find rocks, stones in the rocks. Okay. Defense tool for that scary donkey. No, zombies. For the zombies. Or there could be wolves, actually. Um... Yo, oh, damned, thank you so much for the follow, dude. Appreciate it. Um, we need a long stick. Luckily, we kind of spawned in the same area, actually. Like, thank god. Small. Okay, we need long. We need a big boy. No, we're going the wrong way. Where are we going? Wait, what is happening? Hold on. So confused. Do we need to go this way? Okay, we're definitely moving left. But I think we need to go up a little bit like this. I think I've played this before. This is sort of, um, first playthrough, basically, pretty much. I think we need to go this way. We have, uh, about nine hours into the game. So pretty new. I think we're up here. But I need to get back to my stuff before it despawns. I'm gonna, like cry if I don't find that backpack okay long stick worst part is trying to find your crap again yeah it is I'm not quite sure why I'm not uh, mad at this game for like dying I mean that was like pretty hilarious right I'm, uh, I don't know. The way I'm approaching this game is that it's a kind of real life simulator. And that kind of thing just happens. So I know there was a shack where I died and I was like kind of like up on the hill a little bit, like cresting. 
So as long as I can see that shack and kind of crest a little bit, then I know it's got to be along this ridge right here. Didn't see that church. I think we're like more here. I don't really know. Last time I lucked out, when I died, it was right outside of town. So I knew like where my stuff was because I just had to find the town again. But this one is a drop in the kind of the middle of nowhere. So this is a little harder to find stuff. See, I don't remember this, uh, this church here before. We were maybe here. Oh boy, this is gonna suck. I don't find my stuff. I'm definitely way past the line because now I'm in A4. I don't want to be in A4. Maybe I was on this other hill over here? I feel like that's possible. Cause up there you can see the lake too. This is gonna suck. confident it was in this area somewhere. And all the stuff when it's on the ground is like super hard to see too. So that kind of sucks. But it's also like that in real life too, so understandable. Does this look familiar, guys? Did it look like this before? I didn't remember it being that steep of a hill, though. Maybe it was. I don't know, damn it. All the patches of rocks look the same too. Rip. <laughs> this looks familiar, yep, trees, rocks must be the same. Ugh. Okay, hold on. So here is a ridge type situation here. Does this look familiar? This is like real life, like me getting lost in the woods. Oh, oh, there's a shack. There's a shack. Okay, so it's here somewhere. It's definitely here somewhere. I remember being this way, a little further this way. But that's the shack. That is definitely the shack. So it's, uh, it's definitely here somewhere. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that's the shack that I was looking for. Honestly, I saw it, but it's to my right, down the rocks. That is definitely the one I was looking for. Okay, so, uh, it's definitely, like, in front of me somewhere here. Okay. Oh my god. I'm so excited, guys. Okay, so a little further down, I think. Because I remember the shack being 
maybe like this. Oh my god, there it is. Yes. Eat shit. I got it. Found it. Yes. Whew. Even before same shack. Nope. Nope. This is it. We got it. Let's go. What you should do is in before the zombie comes up and kills my ass while I'm looting my stuff again. That's what you should be in before. <laughs> uh... <laughs> okay. Here's my willy warmer. I already have one, so I don't need another one. Uh, I'm just gonna drop it. Um, equip. 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 And luckily, all that stuff is still in my backpack, so thank god. Um, and that's it, I think. And we're back. Here we are. Here we are. We're back. Maybe I was a little further back when I died the first time. Or, uh, not died. Oh, I gotta pee. Uh, how do I do that? Uh. Don't look, guys. I got the willy warmer, so you can't see. Write your name, right? Taking a shit. <laughs> this game is like pretty funny. <laughs> Gross. Okay. Wow, colon is still 46%. I have 17, I have 1,709% fiber, dude. I think I'm fine with fiber. Um, starvation phase four still. All right. Immersive, right? How did my stick go? Hey, why can't I put it there? Hey, Nikki Poo, thanks so much for the follow, dude. Appreciate it. I don't understand why I can't put it there. I don't understand why this block is blocked out. It's red. Black and red. Red square need, 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 means it needs repaired. Okay. How do I... Oh... Probably need a sewing kit, right? But I don't have a sewing kit. I see. Oh, same thing with my letter, uh, my belt thing. Um, need a sewing kit. Okay. Yeah, I don't have a sewing kit. I do have thread though. And uh... oh, bone needle. So if I kill a zombie, I can get bone. I can make a bone needle out of their bones. Alright, I will keep that in mind. Oh god, no, it's getting dark or something. Um... I'm back, love your headgear. Thanks. You can see my mask. 
There's a lot of Halloween, uh, Halloween masks in this game. All right, we're gonna head back to that town. I don't have a rain jacket. Oh wait, no. Oh no, I gotta go back and get all the clothes. I thought I took my clothes already. Yeah, I think that was it. Okay. I don't have a rain jacket, though, unfortunately. Do you know you can't smoke and drink in this game? What do you mean? You could definitely- you could drink, uh, there's alcohol you can drink, for sure. Uh, I saw cigarettes, too, in the game. I didn't do any of that, but... I didn't do the cigarettes, I mean. They got beer in the game, they got hard liquor, they got a lot of stuff in the game. In fact, that, uh, capsule thing- oh shit. In fact, that capsule thing had a bunch of beer. <laughs> Eat shit. Welcome back, pickle dicks. I was actually wondering if it would, um... Oh, look at the money. I was actually wondering if it would um, make my vision blurry or something if I drank a lot. Hey, what's going on, Cujo? Yes, it will, and you can pass out and even die from drinking too much alcohol on here. Gotcha. I mean, that makes sense. I, I, I didn't really drink a lot of alcohol. I haven't yet, so hopefully that won't be a problem for us. No, oh, thank you, Cujo, for the follow, and thank you, Rose, also for the follow. Appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much. I like that you can run or move while you look at your inventory and stuff. That's pretty nice. In uh, point six release, you will have addictions like alcoholic and smoking. Oh, nice. That's pretty cool. Well, you know what I mean. <laughs> it's cool that they're adding uh, features like that. Uh, what game is this? This is Scum. This is a new game that we're streaming. And a uh, new game to me. It is a open world survival... Crazy hardcore zombie survival game. Very different than what we're used to here. It's so pretty. Hey, do you guys know, um, for anyone that plays, do you guys know if there's like a photo mode? Like something I could take screenshots, pictures of? It's just a reindeer headband, the old X. Because I would love to take photos in this game, but I can't seem to figure out how. And just like Googling, I was not able to find anything. 
unfortunately. So I don't know if that's like a maybe the mechanic is not there. No photo mode, just screenshots. Oh, that's too bad. Do you guys know if they plan on adding camera mode? I feel like the game's chugging a little bit on the stream. They will go to your Steam page. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Looks rainy over there. Hopefully they, uh, the, the devs plan on a camera photo mode. I would like that a lot. The game is just too pretty and with like too many elements to not be able to take photos, I think. That is definitely a wolf. Also, it's getting to be nighttime, I think, and I don't have a light of sorts, and I know... Oh shit, oh shit, oh god. I know it gets hella dark. Oh my god, don't die, please. Eat shit, wolf, no. Oh my god, why am I not hitting him? Yes, run away, run away. Oh my god. Craft a torch, I don't know how. Do you need like matches? Oh no, I'm hurt. Okay, I'm bleeding. Uh... Was that a zombie? Wolf zombie? I don't really know if it was a zombie, but it was definitely a wolf. Uh... I assume you can't tame wolf pupper? Probably not. That would be really dope though, if you could. It's in the crafting menu. Uh, how do I get rid of that? Um, maybe just eating? I have a leg wound. How do I get rid of that? I know my health is low. Might have to just rest, maybe? It's in the crafting menu? There we go. Okay, so definitely eating. All you need to light it is a fire drill. You can craft that too. Okay. Oh my god. The outside. <laughs> Stick and banish is all you need. Okay, cool. Uh, I'll definitely check that out. Can they come in, you think? Come on in. <laughs> e 
Eat it. Crash, uh, build house yet? No, I have not built any shelter yet. Uh, I would like to find a, a car and then uh, bring it somewhere and then build the shelter somewhere. I really want to find a car. Second advantage is all you need to think. People mindful you will stand like a beacon for other players. Well, playing a single player, so I don't think there's any worry about other players right now, right? Hello, Krieg. Good morning, Krieg. Solo, solo. Yeah, so I don't think I have to worry about people seeing me because we're not online. So that's fine. I've owned Scum since three days after coming out. Never played single player yet. Didn't sound like fun. Understood. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, I just want to learn basics basically before I jump into multiplayer, whether it's a PvE or PvP. Or I could have two different games going, just a different different uh, kind of play style, I think. Oh, we got a flare. I don't want to use a flare, though. Probably. Um... Okay, so what were those crafting things? Um, okay. Um, sausages. Those do not look like sausages to me. What? Here. <laughs> um, hmm. Bonfire. Fire ring. Standing torch? I don't want a standing torch, though. I want something that I can carry, I think. Do they not have something that I can carry? Uh, yeah, I jumped in with no knowledge of what I was doing. Nice. Yeah, I think this game has, like, a very steep learning curve. There's a dildo arrow, too. Oh, my God. Uh, blast cap... Tire repair kit. Improvised flashlight? No. I don't have a flashlight. What the hell? Okay. Um. Oh my god. Where is it? I'm trying to look for some kind of lighting tool, Krieg. Something that will give me light, because I know nighttime is going to come, and I remember last time it's like wicked dark. I mean, handheld is fine. I just want to be able to move around and still be able to see where I'm going. Otherwise, it's just like literally pitch black. I can't see anything. So anything that can help me see in the dark. I don't really see anything, though. Hey, Mr. Wayne, what's going on, dude? How's it going? Hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah, I don't really see anything. I mean, I see the, that fire thing. A torch, standing torch, but I don't s There it is, where? 
You can't hear me? You can't hear me? Can you guys hear me? You know what I wish it had? I wish it was a search button. Like search, type in a search for torch or something. This one. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. There you go. Thank you, Kujo. Okay. This under items. Okay. So we need a long stick. And we need rags. We already have rags. Uh, we don't have a long stick. We already have rags though. All right. So let's go find a stick. In the rain. We all wish for that. Long stick. Nice. <laughs> it's raining, you screwed. The torch won't stay lit. Yeah, I mean... I would like to be able to have the tools just to have it. Wait, when I craft it, can I have a t torch that's not lit and leave it in my- and like, uh, put it in my bag or something though? I don't have room for any of this stuff. Jesus. I got too much shit. I'm not gonna have room for this stick, am I? Oh, I might. It's like super long. There we go. Oops. Fine, I don't have room for my- oh no, I have room for my fishing rod, okay. I don't have room for my saw now. Also, am I gonna catch hyperthermia standing out here? Probably, right? There we go. Okay. All right. Go back into my barn. Ha! Huh. You can rotate items if you hold down. Yep, I already know that. Uh, got. TD2 installed again, gonna test it out after the Uplate is done downloading. Sweet, Mr. Lane. Well, hopefully, uh, after- wait, did you get your, um, RAM? Your second RAM? Hopefully, uh, the game works out when you, uh, load it up. Craft torch instead of having stick in inventory, the torch is smaller. Well, I wanted to get out of the RAM, so... First. Uh, what's this? I know it's called Scum, but... Uh, so Scum is a kind of open world survival type of game. There are zombies, there are wild animals that can attack you. I'm playing in single player mode so there aren't uh, real live players that can kill me. Uh, but there is a multiplayer mode and I don't know if you have to play like select servers to play on. I think you do. I don't know how to select servers but I did join one. Um, you know. Uh, okay. Okay, so if I can torch, get a torch, um, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna craft this torch. I'm gonna have to put it somewhere, though. 
I guess it doesn't matter. I'm just gonna craft it first. Boom. I won't backseat game you. Like, yeah, fun. Sorry, it's easy to guess. So thanks, man. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, I definitely don't like uh, backseat gaming. But if I if I need help, I will uh, definitely ask and appreciate people uh, answering when I need help. Okay, so uh, that's a big boy. Okay. I'm gonna guess this, uh, how do you like turn it on? That's what she said. Fuel with fire, oh, gunpowder. I have gunpowder, don't I? I did earlier. I need the fire drill, okay. Hmm. Oh, uh, you need the, f what's a fire drill though? I don't understand what a fire drill is. Can you not be in the rain? Uh, you can be, but I think uh, I'll get wet and then my body temperature will come down and I maybe I might get sick. Probably. So there's tinder, fire drill, a drill made out of wood to create enough incendiary friction to start a fire. Okay, so I have a saw. I have a stick. Well, I don't have a stick anymore. It's outside, but. Um, okay, I have to go back outside and grab more sticks then. Um, all right. We got zero vitamin D, rip. When I kill myself, I'm still hungry. I can't find any food. I think you're like hungry all the time, pretty much, constantly. That's what I've heard at least. But I basically just drink and eat as I find stuff to drink and eat as I go. Never found matches or lighter? Uh, no, I didn't find either of those, Krieg. Unfortunately, I did not. But I am, I think I'm still looting through the town though. I haven't, uh, I died earlier. I got that cargo drop. Um, I didn't stand far enough away from it when I blew up and I went kaboomed myself. But I did find all my stuff, so we're back in the, when you came on is when we came back into the town. Yes, yeah, the same one from yesterday, the same one from last night. <laughs> Uh, but I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I have to, like, pee really bad. So, I think if I do this, it should be okay. We're gonna bump the music. You guys can catch him. And, uh, I'm just gonna run to the bathroom. I'll be back.
Right, in, uh, in single player, you can pause the game. Um... Welcome back, Serge. I am also back. I just came back myself. From the bathroom. Alright, let's look this up. I also am enjoying the rain sounds. Hopefully you guys... Hopefully it's loud enough for you guys to hear. Uh... In-game. Single player... Uh... Pause. I gotta give little P her treat too. Stand by, guys. Sorry. How wars and looks good. Hey, Bob. What's going on, Bob? Uh, I had turkey and stuffing. Oh man, lucky. Lucky, Serge. I'm so hungry. I've been like, my stomach has been like growling for like the last two hours. So I'm pretty sure single player, um, if you hit escape, like this menu right here, it pauses the game because I can't hear anything. There's no sounds. <laughs> I can't hear any sounds, so I'm just pretty sure it's paused. If it wasn't paused, I would imagine I would be able to hear the rain sound still, so. Okay, wait. So what we're doing... Okay, we're doing something here. We want to do this. Alright, I want a long stick. Give me a long stick. Another long stick. Do you can't swap things? It's kind of annoying, actually. I can't put that there, it's weird. Okay. Alright, never mind then. the food gauge is not working right but you can still replenish from being hungry i don't know if it's working right or not but i feel like i'm always starving Like, you can definitely, um, like, like, in real life, you can definitely, um, be without food for, like, whoa. You can be without food for many days, but the, uh, thirst is the one you gotta work, work uh, be careful of, at least in real life, and probably in this game. What the hell is that sound? That's the drone, but what is that weird squeaky sound? Hi. Hi. Okay. Uh, gotta go. So cheers for streaming. Hey, thanks. Thanks for being here, Em. Appreciate you. Have a great day. We'll see you next time, Em. Hi. Uh, I see Kitty behind. Yeah, Kitty. Little P. 
seven days without food. I think it's more like 21 days without food, actually. But I'm no expert. But I think it's way more than seven days. What does the drone want to say to me? Alright, we haven't searched down that stuff yet either. This is a big place. We've only done these houses over here. Take more thread. Five days without water and a couple weeks without food. That makes sense. Makes more sense. Tire repair kit. Sounds like something I would want, but I don't have space. I don't have space. I gotta drop some of all this stuff that I'm hoarding that I don't need. Um, should we forgo fishing, I guess? What is in this, anyway? So in the A grid sections, yes, we are kind of bottom middle of A3. Oops. Same place, same place we we're at yesterday, or at where I was at yesterday, Creed, when you were watching last night. Um. Drop the padlocks. Drop the padlocks because no one's gonna. Oh my god, that's scary. Uh, because no one's gonna steal my house, or my car, or anything, because I'm not playing PvP, I guess. Yo, thank you, Castle, for the 17 months. Let's go. Uh, would you say scummy sub for the scummy game? Thanks, Castle. Appreciate it, dude. Um, I forgot the tire picket. There we go. I don't want to use this before the drill press or whatever. What do you what are you making it? that it drops uh, whatever I put in its hand. I guess I put in the, the holster because I had room, but... I think the one thing that I don't like and don't understand is why do I craft something and it drops on the f ground? Even if I have room for it in my, like, storage space. Like, I don't understand why it drops. Works with your crafting menu. Checking those windows, Krieg. Oh my god. There's a lot. There's more than one.
It's always on that. Is it upstairs? It is. Ah! Oh, it's fast. Get wrecked. See if they have anything good. Puppet eye. What does that mean? What? Can be used with Halloween mask. Okay, so it's nothing. Fast boy? Yeah, it was wicked fast. That's a plug in the back of your head. Is it? What happened to my shirt? Did I lose my shirt? That's how the drones find you and relays the info back to the warden. Hmm. How is the fishing in this game? Has anyone done that? Is it ridiculously hard to fish? Yeah, we'll drink this nasty coffee. Whoops. Wait, what happened? Did I drink it? Or is it empty? can't see it. Ugh. Where's this last thing? Oh, there we go. Nasty coffee. Some nasty coffee for you, Krieg. <laughs> Didn't know you could fish too. Well, so, uh, I don't know if you could fish too, but I think you can. Yeah, that's the police station. Yep, I recognized it, Krieg. Uh, I didn't know you could fish too, because I've never done it, but there is the fishing reel that I found that I dropped earlier. Uh... And I found some fish bait and stuff like that. But I haven't uh, done it yet myself. Careful, careful, I might throw up, maybe. I've got some more uh, ammo here. 
High stack. What's this join? Oh, okay, stack. Cool. Oh, stack. Perfect. Batteries. Uh, electrical devices such as flashlights, smartphones, and electric cars. That would be nice, actually. So I had a bunch of bread, soft drink, soft drink. Looks like my bladder is going up. Um, wish I had a sewing repair kit. Oh, okay. Since I killed that zombie out there, I should be able to get a bone. Chop them up and get the bones. And then we can do a sewing kit. And then I can repair my quiver thing and then take that arrow out. Wait, his body's gone. Where'd his body go? Oh no. I guess his body just spawned, despawned, but his clothes stayed there. That's weird. All right, well, next zombie, I guess. Oh shit. Oh, the upstairs. Come at me, bro. Oh, the animation didn't work. Perfect. make a bone needle. Here it is. And then we're gonna craft a improvised sewing kit. And then we'll repair our quiver, and then we're gonna put our arrow in there. So that should free up some of my inventory space. A little more too. Probably. How do I do it though? Uh... Oh, I should have. I should, probably should have uh, repaired my backpack instead. Shit. Oh, you can use them multiple times. Oh, all my stuff is like breaking. Okay. can actually hear those cogs turn over. I wonder if it's worth it to like wait until more of it breaks to use the repair kit or it just uses whatever it uses, I wonder. Uh Okay. Let's 
So there's no other use for this, right? If I'm not playing with other people, the phone, I assume. Just leave it alone. Use your pokey stick. No, you haven't seen my willy warmer yet, have you, Bob? Hey, look, it's uh, it's your jacket, Krieg. Phones for crafting bombs. Okay. Interesting. Okay, I did not know that. Um, so we no longer have a crowbar because we used that at the cargo drop. So we can't open those. Not that again. Ha! <laughs> 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 huh. Like this pickaxe. It's way better than that wooden spear for uh, killing zombies. Actually, these things have guns in it, probably. Yes, they, they do normally, or ammo. Oh, I wish I had something to open it. Is like crowbar the only thing you can use to open those? I think there's lock picks, right? Can you craft a lock pick? I found an MP5 in one last night. Oh man. Okay, so I should really figure out how to get into those lockers then at the police station. Sounds like it would be super helpful. Improvised short pedal. Funny. Um, for lock picks, now if you find a screwdriver and a craft a lock pick, you can something. Safety pins and screwdrivers need. Okay, I don't have safety pins. I saw them earlier, but I didn't pick it up. Seeing you guys making fun of me. Oh no, safety pin. I know where it is though, I think. I think it's uh, outside in the thingy, the shack thingy. Uh, I wonder if it's still there though. It might have despawned already. Okay, so this one's just a safety pin. Do those come in boxes or it's just single item? Sorry, sausage fingers. No problem, dude. Um, both, okay. Single and box. Gotcha. Thanks. Alright, well, I can't do anything about it now, I guess, because I don't think I have anything, right? Let me see. All I got is nails. Alright, well, we're screwed. We dropped this, too. Um, okay. Well, rip. Both. Cool. Oh, wait, what is this? Okay. Um, I like that. I feel like I'm getting chunkier now. I'm like getting fatter. 
That looks like some ammo or something. Cool. Okay. Cool. Or in crafting as a makeshift lockpick. Okay. Uh, okay. We made a lockpick. If you have too much inventory, you can craft a box, put stuff in the box, bury the box, but since you're on single player, you don't need to bury it. Uh, well, I don't wanna, I don't really wanna set up shop anywhere yet because if i create a box or if i make a box and bury it somewhere i'm gonna have to go back to that place right i'm still just kind of roaming um i prefer to get a car so i can go somewhere to find a place to set up shop so i don't really want to be bur burying stuff or anything like that at the moment Nomad style. Yep, that's right. So the question is, which one do I want to try to open? And how many uses do I get with a lockpick? Are you going to build a base? I mean, maybe? I feel like this room is probably better. How do I... Can I lockpick this? How does this work? I have to urinate. You need a screwdriver. Okay. Should I just pee here? I guess I'll just pee here then. Alright, stand by. Okay, so I can't open any of these yet then, still. Uh... What the hell did it go? Where did the lockpick go? There it is. Okay. Alright. Um. Okay. We'll look for a screwdriver. Um. Already went all the way to the top. There's nothing in there. Should we drink some nasty coffee again for Creek? Maybe in the snow, but we're not in snow areas right now, so probably not gonna happen. <laughs> okay. I think I got everything here. Hey, snake driver. What's going on, dude? How's your puppy? How's your dog doing? Is she doing any better? <gasps> Doritos. Can I do anything here? Pen... Half used for food after being processed while green or pickled. Can I eat it? Looks like I can. After being processed, so I can't eat it then? 
Raw rotten. Okay, never mind. She's doing this potentially better. Thanks for asking. Cool, cool. Good. That's uh, great news. I you to scum yet or still on the fence. I've never been on the fence about this game ever since I started. Let's just say. <laughs> Where are you coming from? Where are they at? Oh, they're in here. Hi. <laughs> it is definitely Krieg's fault. Blame Krieg for sure. Uh, the only thing I was uh, on the fence about was streaming the game, not not playing the game. I was uh, pretty interested uh, in it since the first time I saw it. I think I already had it on my wish list on Steam actually for a while, just because uh, it looked kind of cool when it came out. But I didn't really look it up or anything. But I uh, oh, toolbox, interesting. Okay, I don't need this mask. But uh, I did watch Creek play it before, and I got pretty interested in that. And here we are. Here we are. Car repair kit. Yeah, I'm getting so many like tools. <sighs> just eat this bread. Get it over with. Uh, I just uh, finished uh, eating a homemade tomato risotto with shrimp and fresh parsley, shredded Parmesan cheese. It was so good. Yo, you're flexing your cooking skills, dude. That sounds really good. Piece of rubber. What can you use with that for that? Another? Wait, is it the same? This is the same one. I don't want to hold it though. Can I add these together or what? I don't understand why you can't stack money together. That's so stupid. Yeah, what's going on, Blimey? Are people, uh, I s you spelled scum wrong on the about section on your page? You can't spell scum the way it's spelled. Cujo. It gets blocked by Twitch. That's why I spelled it that way. FYI. Uh, are people in this game friendly or do you ever never run into people? I'm playing single player mode, which is offline, blimey, so I don't run into people. <laughs> so I think it depends on the server you're playing on. If you run into people or not but for me i'm playing single player uh so there's no one i don't want to be holding the car repair kit in my hands um goodbye feather i feel like the gunpowder is useful because i think it could light the torch All right, uh, padlock can go away. Or that. What? It's huge. Okay. How long is it? How big is this? How big is this? Um, I'm trying to make room, but it's proving difficult.
Um, what can I put down here? Looks like it's long, too. Okay. Um, Oh my god. Oh, wow. I can also see um, nutritional facts on this as well. I didn't know that. Wow, okay. Cool. So I think I should get this game or not. I mean, it's on pre <coughs> pretty decently uh, priced uh, right now, actually, in Steam, right? It's on sale. That's when I got it. It's pretty cheap, I think. Let's just say I've definitely uh, enjoyed my time in this. And yes, Bob... Uh, Inventory uh, simulator, yeah. I guess the game is making a thing. Yeah, this game is like, it's really interesting. I, uh, I'm uh, very surprised that I like this game as much as I do. I'm pretty, uh, pretty impressed. There's a lot of stuff happening in this game. Okay, duct tape, go away. I really want this repair kit. Can I fit this here? Oh my god, I can't fit there. Okay. I gotta move a lot more stuff. Makes sense though. Cause you can't put a car repair kit in your jacket pocket. Probably. Makes sense. Okay. This. There we go. There we go. It's like Tetris. It's like Tetris Simulator. Um, okay. Anything I want back here? I want. Screw it. Screw it. Yeah, it's worth percent off for now. Next time I find a bar of soap, read what it really what read what it says. I haven't seen any soap at all, but yeah, I'll uh, try to remember that. I remember seeing this game a long time ago, I thought it looked really fun and weird, just remembered it. Yeah, same, same blimey. Yeah, I heard about this game like, you know, years ago when it first came out, and I added it to my wish list, but didn't really think much about it, but until more recently. Thanks, Greg. Uh, 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 thanks, Greg. But I'm glad, though, that I waited this long to play it, because it's got, like, so many, um, like, features now that I probably didn't have before years ago, you know? Ooh, mask, new mask. Uh, yes, please. Well, I can't really see myself, but that's all right. <clears throat> Came out in 2018. Looks like Tarkov, but not depressing. Tarkov? Like, I also picked up Tarkov, too. Um, I mean, I had Tarkov, but I didn't really play it that much until more recently. And honestly, kind of picked up both games around the same time, which was like last weekend, basically, or two weekends ago. And I would say the inventory is very similar. Probably the shooting in the game. I haven't shot in this game yet because I haven't found a gun. It's probably going to be just as janky as, as it is in Tarkov and like PUBG. And by janky, I mean just very not smooth, such as stuff like Call of Duty, which I play, uh, or The Division. Um, but I think it's more realistic, which is kind of what I'm going for here, I think, is uh, a more realistic game. The version 0.5 you are playing now just came out a couple weeks ago. Um, yep, yeah, yep. Uh, 
I don't know if I like the skull mask, actually. I think I'm gonna not, actually. I'm gonna take this back. Where did it go, though? There it is. I guess I'll take it along with me in case I change my mind. Ooh, batteries. Yes. Any monies? No. Ooh, barbed wire. I don't know if I can use that for. What does the bow shooting look like? Yeah, I have no idea actually. I uh, I got that recently from that cargo drop. I haven't used it yet, so I don't know. No idea. <clears throat> I know that the water has uh, sharks because uh, I was watching Jeff and A last night um, get eaten by shark, but he made it alive. He made it out alive. I haven't been in the water myself. Oh my god. I think it's upstairs. Oh my god. See ya. Oh shit, it's still alive. Yeah, this game is quite interesting, to be honest. It's uh, a lot more complicated than games I normally play, and the games I play are very not complicated, which is why I play those games. So this is quite a 180 in terms of game category that I usually play. Mm, I think that's it. The stairs are a little janky. Um, it kind of stutters a little bit. So that's weird. Ooh. I might trade this. It's a little better, but it's pretty much the same. Not my fault. Definitely your fault, Krieg. Definitely your fault. Nail magnifying glass. Produce a magnified image of an object. Okay, so who cares? Is that gonna do anything for me? Probably not. Skip it. I'm gonna have to hop off of here soon, guys. A little later than I uh, usually stream. Stay on until. But I'm having so much fun. I didn't even realize what time it was. Um, okay. Looks like it's getting dark out. 
fish again or something. got room for it. it looks like i have an old one is this one better yes it is okay drop perfect perfect Like the sun is going down ish. Isn't there a military base that has guns? I mean, I know there's a naval base over here. I haven't been there yet. No. probably has guns right but I don't have the tools to open the locked compartments in the police station pretty sure the military base has like robots too I make my own gun? Isn't that like an improvised 50 cal though or something? How does that work? Uh, where is it? This something. This one. Improvised handgun 50 cal. High risk, high reward. Yeah, exactly. It's like, it's got the gigantic robot there. It's like a mech warrior. Probably instantly die. Um... So I can actually make this, I think. Okay, wait, can someone explain what this is? <clears throat> um, so the little cogwheel gear thing, what does that mean? And I assume the numbers mean that this is the one, one f first item I need, second item, third item, fourth item, fifth, sixth item. But what does the cogwheel mean? Does that mean I have this somewhere? So I just found out today or yesterday that you can like click on the arrow thingy to show you what other components you can use to craft these things, which is weird and I didn't know before. But like, so this has like a green, the green little thingy there around the number and this one has a green thingy they all do except for the last one i don't understand what what it is a little green thing it might be hard to see for you guys so i just dumped a lot of that uh duct tape earlier i knew i was hoarding it for some reason And there was a metal pipe somewhere too, and I don't remember where it was. Uh, rip, rip. If you have the gear, it has the area below. Right, yeah, like this area below, I know that. But I just don't understand what some of these icons mean up here. 
Oh. I think I know what it means. I think I know what it means. I think I know what it means. So the last one, the metal saw, it has a hammer because it's a tool, probably, of some sort. But then the other ones have the wheel. Maybe it's because it's a component of sorts or something. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'll like I'll take a screenshot of it and uh, show you later, Krieg or something, because it's like it's probably kind of hard to see, because it's probably blurry and stuff on the stream. I'll uh, I'll take a picture of it later. <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll I'll send it to you later. <laughs> Forget it. <laughs> I think I know what it means, but we can confirm later on. Crafting item, maybe. Bubbles. Hmm. Whoa, that was weird. See, there you go. Wine. Wait, what can you do with that? There's your nutritional facts, guys. Yes, that's what it means. Cool. Okay, cool. That only took me 10 hours to figure out in the game. All right, let's do one more house and call it quits, guys. I'm starving. Is there, is there one more house? Maybe I don't have any more houses. I've not seen one single workable, usable car here, by the way. And this place is supposed to have like 10 possible spawns of stuff. All right, I'm just gonna chill back in this house. I'm gonna hide in this bathroom. I'm gonna sit here. Okay. Okay, so the only thing I need, um, from this is the test on the server some of a timer about 30 minutes I see so we we'll just sit here and not do anything for 30 minutes and things will respawn um I feel like we can make this Handmade 50 cal soon. It looks like I just need wood. <laughs> I just need to get me some wood. Although, I don't have a metal pipe. Right? I only have a metal pipe. I have a saw. I have metal scrap. I have nails. And I have rubber band. I just need wood and pipe i think maybe i don't know i don't know i don't know guys i don't know I'm confused um but i think that's gonna be it for today guys let me know if you guys uh enjoyed that content of me running around um when the house is moving stuff as I think this was fun, and I feel like I could, uh, I could maybe play more of this game. Maybe stream more of this game. Um, balance board, let's go. Thanks, Allie. Yeah, let me know what you guys think. And, uh, if you guys are new here to the channel, uh, don't forget to smash that follow button if you guys enjoyed the content today. Uh, we are going to do the balance board here in a second. I want to pause it to make sure I don't die. But yeah, I think this game is really interesting. There's a lot of uh, kind of different elements to the game that I'm not normally used to, and I think that's, I guess, maybe a good thing in this case. Um,
Lots to learn? Yeah, definitely. I was wondering what that sound was. That's pretty funny. Now I got like crumbled up cat treat on my floor. Perfect. <clears throat> oh, sabotage, right? Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot of definitely a lot of stuff to learn, uh, Bob. And uh, game's interesting. This is the first game that I've played for this long now, um, and I haven't shot a single gun yet. And let's see, I've been playing this game for how long, I can't really see, but probably 10 hours, over 10 hours now, probably. And, uh, it's, uh, like I said, it's interesting. A lot of elements to it. There's vehicles, which I haven't found yet still. Um, uh, looking forward to finding vehicles and guns, because guns, because I like guns. But anyway guys, uh, that's gonna be it for us today. Gotta make dinner, I'm pretty starving. Been starving for the last three hours, more or less, since lunch, basically. Appreciate you guys being here. Have a good one, JJ. Thanks for being here. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel, please smash that follow button if you guys enjoyed the content today. And also, uh, come join the Discord at this link there in chat and we'd love to have you here and uh it's it'll be the best way to kind of hang out with us um with the community off stream and also it's a good place for me to um to find out where when i am not streaming aka if i'm sick or something like that but otherwise thanks krieg um see you later snake driver give your puppy your your dog all the the puppy treats for me, please. GG, brother Xiao. See you later, Bob Cobb. Um, should we go raid someone? Let's see who we got. Let's see who we got. Um, let's see. Have a nice walk. Yo, it is so windy out right now. Bob, it's 24 miles per hour. Pretty sure if I went outside, I'd probably get blown. To hell <laughs> i can't i probably get blown over speaking of getting blown over uh quick story before we leave uh when i had uh hamstring surgery i um when i had after i had a hamstring surgery i uh had a handicap uh placard so that i could park like you know at the front in the parking lots for the stores because it was hard for me to walk basically but since it was my left leg, um, I was able to drive after like a long while. But I still had the, the handicap placard for a while. And uh, I kept the handy pla uh, handicap placard. Uh, that is really hard to say with my Invisalign's on, just so you know. Um, I kept the handicap placard in my door, like on the side pocket in my driver's door, driver's side door. And uh, I like kicked open the door one day and it was like super mega wicked windy out and the wind like 
blew my placard, my sign, out into this parking lot. And uh, <clears throat> so I'm like kind of limping towards like towards the placard because it's like, you know, several feet from my car by now because the wind's blowing it. And I finally went to like go pick it up and uh, I, I like squatted down and the wind was blowing so hard. I like basically just about fell over and I don't weigh that much. So it was pretty funny. I pretty much just fell over. So you can imagine if I went outside now, it's 25 probably gonna be pretty windy for me so probably not gonna go for a walk today Bob <laughs> long story short there <laughs> all right guys let's see um anyone to bring to see let's see no we're just gonna go offline we're just gonna go have dinner um we'll see you guys later uh Creek I'll probably be back on later uh if you're around everyone else have a good night guys thank you guys for being here appreciate all of your support um today and we'll be back tomorrow thursday at 1 p.m we'll see you guys then have a great night enjoy the rest of your day guys and we'll see you guys soon see ya bye love you all bye <laughs>